have everything. Everything that money can buy. A house, cars, you name it. But one thing is missing. Seven months gone and no man has looked at me in admiration. It's like I don't exist. Maybe I do not exist. Maybe I am my own problem. Perhaps I'm too weird. I need to loosen up. I need to loosen up. I'm a woman. A beautiful woman. You know I'm going for an interview today. Besides, all my clothes are worn out. Huh? So? I, I, I don't understand. Make I use empty body take go work. Ah, uh -uh, now. Why are you talking like this? You have plenty of them inside the wardrobe. Choose one of them. When I come back, I'll, I'll wash this one and keep for you. you know? Ah, all oh, these are plenty, plenty stories all the time. You should know that me, myself, with the city also, I'm not get. I'm sorry now. I'm sorry, babe. You better wash it all. Yes, I will, I will. I will wash it. I was expecting you to wish me luck now. Huh? Wish me luck. I'm going for an interview. I need this job. If I get this job now, I can buy plenty of things for you. You're my guy now. It's okay. It's okay. okay. Yeah, anyway, good luck, good luck. Good luck, my guy. Good luck. Ah, I'm trying to boss this thing so I can get all the money I have saved. <laughs> we are you talking about the someone better money this Let me just check one of these things in the world. Oh, I know. Thanks, man. Gucci? Mm -hmm. Yesterday after using it. It's not fair. Uh uh. Julie, I am really sorry. I'm so sorry. It's not a plug. It's real. It was in reserve when I left the house this morning. And now I am stranded. I hate to be upset. I just hate getting angry in the morning. Okay, okay. Then. Well, you can take a cab and get yourself called from one of the police stations. Right? That is the problem. I have important documents in the car, and the key is bad. Uh, you know what? I'll see what I can do. Okay? Do you have a gallon in the car? I. Yes. Okay. I told you I'm on my way. Just get a data of those who came for the interview and clean up my office. Oh. Yes, I'm back, madam. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Do you have a funnel? Yes, I have. It's in the trunk. Okay. Bring it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
at least now you can catch up with your appointments. Yes. Um, let me give you my card so give me a call. Oh, your card? Fine. No problem. Hello. Oh, your card. I will definitely call you. Please do. Yes. Uh... Excuse me. Are you all right? Oh yes, yes. I'm. I'm. I'm fine. I have a bike man waiting for me. Okay. You can go ahead with your appointments. I. I don't want to stress you. I am serious. I can give you a lift. No, I'm fine. Seriously, I'm fine. Okay. Thank you. Please do give me a call. Of course, I, I will call you. Thank you, you so much. You're welcome. Life oh, yes, yes, I am. <laughs> There's, there's, there's a little problem, oh. perhaps the problem will not affect my money. Oh. Uh, that's what I'm talking about now. You see, I, I think you have to just take me back to the house. Let me get money and, and, and pay you. Take you back to the house? Yes. I, 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 I don't know what happened to the money I had in my pocket. I think it fell off. So it, it, it's better we just go back to the okay. house and then I'll... Give me my money. Give me my money. Wait, can we go go where woman there? They show yourself. Any eye. This say I can't come Oh, okay. it doesn't go into that now. What I'm saying? If I... You're embarrassing me. I'm going for, for a job interview for Christ's sake. Oh, you are going for a job interview. You know that skin no fool. I didn't talk about that. It's a con Lagos company. Okay. Give me my money. Oga, okay. Oga, okay. hold on now. Hold on, wait. I'll, I'll, I'll give you the money. Just take me back to the house and and, and let, let, let me get a, a, a fresh cash and give to you. Not you to have... give me my money. I need my money now. I know they carry the go anywhere. Okay. Give me my no. money. Okay, no. I'm going to look at him. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm going to look at him. Oh God, please, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Just, just take me to the house, please. I beg you. I can't take you to the house. Give me, give me my money. Oh, give me my money. I promise you I'll give you money. I, I have money which in the can, house. Which can wish be this one? I did that. Oh God, we're blocking the way. I, 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 I'll, I'll, I'll give you money. Give me my money. I beg you. not know, enough. We didn't talk about that. You're blocking the road. You're blocking the road. What? 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 You're blocking the road. What? No, they tell me make a little matter, make a experience here. This man wear this for you, a very wicked person. I carry him, I use my money to go buy gallon. We go police station, buy for a finish. I carry him, I can't go one place again. I can't come here now, they tell me saying money lost. Which can't talk to that one? Like that. I when they show yourself where woman is, no, they say no. I just want to go back to the house and How much that is money. the money? No matter what's on here. You're blocking the road. Thank you very much. You need to be more careful next time. Your job interview is very important. Bro. Thank you. Thank you very much. I hope that helps. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you. <laughs> Thank you.
you remember me? I, I was the one that came here that day. I don't remember you before. Wait, are you here for the interview? Um, no, I'm here to submit my proposal. Well, the screen is over and I'm um, instructed not to allow anyone to come. Well, I'm just here to submit my proposal, that's all. Is the chairman where you're coming? Today, it has been a very terrible day for me. If not, he helped me get feel and make sure I was okay before he left. Thank God for him. God bless you. Yeah. 
And I say I wish to see him again. He's such a nice man. Uh, okay, okay. <clears throat> now this is always a look on your face when you see your spec. Mm. Tell me about him. Um, should I say he's my spec? Mm? That I don't know. But he is so good looking <clears throat> and soft spoken. Mm -hmm. That's what I want to hear. Soft spoken. Yes, I know you have a thing for soft spoken guys. So did you collect his number? No. But I gave him my card. Why? I mean, you should have collected his number to say thank you for everything, blah blah. What's his name? Oops. I didn't ask him. Oh I, I was in a hurry. You should have. At least, uh, sweetheart, you need a new man in your life. Wait. You say <laughs> <laughs> that I need a man. Mm -hmm. What about you? So you don't need a man. I do, but at least I dated recently. It's over in Vienna. You haven't even seen a man. You need a man in your life. Finish me. <laughs> I mean, it's all over you. Good afternoon, good afternoon, ma. Um, I live uh, like two poles away from this place. Really? Yes, ma'am. Did you get the job the other time? Um, I didn't get the job. I lost it. Well, I would have gotten the job if I was interviewed. It's just that the receptionist sent me away. The receptionist sent you away? Yeah, I don't know. She just hates me. What company is that? May Rose. A very fine company down. Um, I've forgotten the streets. Mayrose. Yes, ma'am. My dad is actually friends with the owner. I could ask him to go to the ward for you. Really? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Do you have your CV here? Oh, that would be so kind of you. I, I, I don't have it there. It's in the house. And your house is not far from here? No, it? it's not far All from right, here. Oh. <sighs> Thank you very much, ma'am. Sorry for keeping you waiting. I, I had to walk all the way down here. <laughs> nice scent. Thank you very much. My flatmates. Okay. It's, it's, it's nothing. It's fine. Um. Yes. So um. About the the job. I have good news. Unfortunately, or fortunately, the receptionist is going to get punished. But my dad says you can have the job. Give this to the manager. Okay. And give this to the receptionist. Thank you very much, ma. Thank you so much. You're welcome. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you sure. very much. No, yes. wait, wait, no. Step. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm so excited. Yes, I know, but the job is yours, so you don't have to hurry away. Yes, I, I, I know. Thank you, thank you so much. Why don't you drink with me? Just talk, nothing more. I'll drink. The job is yours. You don't have to hurry. All you have to do is go back to the company, give that to the manager, that to the receptionist, and then you resume. Yes, yes, I, I give this to the receptionist then. This is the manager of the life. That's that one. <laughs> Thank you. So we can have a drink? <laughs> okay, fine. Thank you very much, man. God bless you. God bless you. Yes! <sighs> Thank you.
morning, madam. Good morning. I'm out of fuel. Oh, well, you can take a cab and get yourself called from one of the police stations. That is the problem. I have important documents in the car, and the key is bad. Uh, you know what? I'll see what I can do. Okay? Do you have a gallon in the car? I get to love my wife. Who is he that he keeps crossing the line? So, tell me about yourself. I don't have a son. What? Yes. A man who has no job and money has no son. Are you serious? Why would you be so harsh like that on yourself? That's not a yardstick for anything. I mean, fame or money is never a yardstick to describe someone's personality or to measure someone's personality. I'm sorry if that upsets you. I'm not upset, I just... I just feel that life is one step at a time. And those things don't matter at all. Thank you very much for your kind words. You're welcome. And hey, I was going to also help out with some money so you could get some new clothes for your new job. But you've done so much already. I'm fine. It's nothing. Really, I'm certain you need help when it comes to that aspect because it's a new job. Besides, we're friends, right? Yes, we're friends. Thank you very much. Nothing. <laughs> really, just go on. so-called graduates behave like lunatics. Why you always mad? Is it in your blood or you just angry at me? Good question. Yes, I have a problem with you. In fact, I have a problem with guys who just not have decorum. It's alright, well, uh, this letter here is for you. From who? Open it yourself and find out. I am not going to touch this letter unless you tell me who brought it.
Jesus! Oh my goodness! Hey! Let's go see the manager now. Eh? It's their job. No, I'll, see, I'll see her tomorrow. Please, eh, please, eh, my brother. Please, eh. Please, let's go and see her. Let me hold your hand.
Okay, I'll give you a call. Okay. 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 Thank you very much. You're welcome. Would you like to have something? I have water in the Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. Muti, I had a very wonderful day. Ah, I met that girl I had by for the daddy. Do you know who she is? Who is she? She's the manager of my new company. Yes. As a matter of fact, we went out this evening, we had dinner, and then um, my brother, that girl is sharp. I'm tripping. The girl is hot. Hi! Hey! Um, please, my brother, calm down. You have to be very careful. You just said she's your manager. Ah, that makes it easier for me now. Since she's my manager, if I win her heart over, I might become the director now. What? Are you not sharp? Use your... My brother, they calm down. They calm down. Eh? Can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. How are you so sure she's not in your relationship? <laughs> you see, you don't understand me now. I had a personal discussion with this girl. And then she told me that for the past one year, she has not been in any relationship. Are you not seeing it there? Are you not thinking? That's the green light now. Okay, okay, fine. Mika, let me just agree to what you're saying now. But I've been wondered if that girl that helped you with this job now, have you asked her if she's in love with you? In love with me? How can she be? You have a point there. Yes, you, you have a point there, but... The way she was looking at me today... She also gave me some cash. Yes. I said, see, my brother, let me tell you, it is very difficult in this our present country. It is hard to see a woman who will do such a favor without no strings attached. Ah. Well, if you ask me, it's to my own advantage. Mm -hmm. As far as the money's coming, I'm game. <laughs> <laughs> so finally, now it's just a woman. You will not show it to me. Only singular, singular, singular. Now, I wonder if there is this stage for life. And where are you headed with that talk? See, we are the head the way we should share the money and then we will stay house. No, bro, you will get accidents here. Yeah. Just turn your car and head some other way. Yeah. I advise you. Huh? Yeah. You were just advising me about yeah. something and now no. you want to be part of it. You don't use your church and give me 4,000. They will break now. They must break.
dear Judy. It has been also long years past. Weeks. I'm not the kind of man that falls in love with but of course I know. I'm in love with you. And this is my own intuition. It's just my second week here. But does it matter? It's love we're talking about. Personally, going to tell the MD about you. Thank you very much. I have to get back to work. Yeah. 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 Thank you. 
do not respond to my call or my messages. You did not even try to reach me back. No, you didn't reach me back. Anyway, I want to see you tonight. So I'm coming back to your place to pick you up for dinner. Alright? Ma, person they find you for outside. Who? Oh. He talk and say his name na Raska, Ras, 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 Madam, Ras, Ras. Bring him in. I gave you an instruction. I asked you to sell the old trucks. You refused. You kept them and those trucks are now a liability to me. They break down week in, week out. We are spending company money to maintain them. But madam, I ordered for new trucks. But I don't know what the delay is for. You what? You ordered new trucks without my consent. I ordered for 62 trucks as instructed by you. Oh! I'm sorry. Yes, yes, yes. I buy. I call. So why are you here? <laughs> no, please, I'm sorry. I don't know what came over me. I promise it will not happen again, please. But do not fire me. Please, it's not work of the devil. I don't know why I don't like let myself to be used by the devil. I promise it will happen again. Am it's I forgetting something? I mean, who is this? Madam, she is the receptionist you sat a few weeks ago. And since then she has been crying like this. And her mother is very, very sick. You are the one who is tarnishing the company's image. Well, then, please, I look up the devil. Well, then, please, you're a good person. The mother will die. Do not fire me. Please. You are the one who has been tarnishing the company's image. Eat it. Eat it. Give me the brown envelope on my dressing table. Don't matter. You've been the one tarnishing the company's image. You? They use the cost of everything, madam. I'll not have the devil to use me again, I promise. Madam, please. Madam. Give it to me. Take it. Take it. Go and treat your mother. I do not want to see you in my house or in my company. Please. Let's don't stand there. 
Okay. Madam, please, please don't pay me okay. for two months, but okay, please do not fire me, madam. Come on. Please. Let's go. Madam, should I come back? <laughs> it's okay. Madam, please. Francis? Yes. Do you have a girlfriend? Uh, yes, I do. You did have to tell her to look for somebody else. You heard me. I mean, you heard me. Hey, I like you. You see, uh, the truth is, you've been so nice to me. That's what I. I don't think I want to cheat on my girl. I don't want to break your heart. I'm sorry about that. Oh, no, no, I... <laughs> I'm the one who's sorry. It's... I'm sorry, it's... I... Sorry. I'm, tr I'm truly sorry. No, no, it's really you. I mean, you should... You are the definition of an entity of stranger. A woman got created on Sunday night, 6 a.m. The presence is breathtaking. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Oh, if you don't like, I'll have a seat. Oh, sure. So, are you waiting for someone? Oh no, not at all. I come here during the weekend to give myself a treat. So, you are in our category? What category? The single soul of the <laughs> How on earth did you come up with that? <laughs> just, just came up. Done with that thing. Oh. Mm -hmm. okay. So, what about you? What are you thinking? <laughs> sorry about that. No, 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 no. I, I do not want to be so loud. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Okay. So, um, what else do you want to 
look at your drink. Oh, I, I think I'm done with the drink. Oh yeah? Yes. Yeah. What do you want? Well, I do not have a favorite drink. You did. Food is ready. No, Make us have a... I'm not hungry. Madam. Get. Get. Go. Go. Eat it. Go. Sorry, madam. So it was hard for me as a first son after I lost my father. My mother is staunch Christian. She insisted I must give my life to Christ before she hand over my father's company. Can you imagine? I had to go back to Sunday school for four weeks before she handed over my father's company's account. Interesting. At least you were born with a golden spoon. Golden? Yes, golden. I thought it was a silver spoon. Well, silver spoons are usually gold who read it in school. And um, golden spoons are usually those heroes we see that take over the family legacy. Oh. Can you please break it down? Okay. Being done with the golden spoon comes with a lot of responsibility. You have to let go fantasies and focus on reality and greatness. Oh. So which of the categories you belong? I'm not sure I was born with any spoon at all. <laughs> my father was a wine tapper and my mother a petty trader. Well you don't look like someone who has gone through a lot. Should we look like what we've been through? This is the point where hard work binds those who are born with golden spoon, those born with silver spoon, and those born with no spoon at all. Well, I am not just inspired by all you say, but amazed and indeed. Good opportunities instead you create animal cities. Just to please them, just to please them You'll make mistakes that you will regret If you don't wake up to reality It could be too late for you Oh, Julie, Julie, take your calls now, take your calls Fine. I've been trying to read Julie all day, but she's not taking my calls. Regarding last night, what you said so much. Maybe she's not with her phone. How? How can you say that? She's always with her phone now. 
Just a little phone. I know, I know that. She might have dropped the phone somewhere. When she picks the phone, she will return your calls. I know Julie. She's never far from her phone. I know her so well. I really don't have the strength. I had a terrible day to be on this song. Thanks for the drink. Um, I must say that you're really cool, smart, and bold. And I think you're forgetting one of my other friends. You're handsome. Oh, I just wanted you to break it down. <laughs> <laughs> So where is the car? Oh, at the car park. Yes. Uh, I didn't come with mine. It broke down. It has electrical faults. But anyway, my cabman will soon be here to pick me up. Oh. Hey, that's not worry. I'm ready to be a cabman soon. Oh no 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 no. I don't want to bother you no no. I'm pleased, and I will be glad to do that. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Your emotions will be toyed with. Yes, it will. The decisions and actions will be affected negatively. You'll be manipulated. Oh, and taking advantage of. Yeah, even when you find the one that's good for you. Fantasy love, you were blinded by fantasy love. confusion and commotion in your life if you love the wrong one you will make wrong decisions take the wrong actions just to please them you could miss good opportunities instead you create animal cities just to please them just to please them you make mistakes that you will regret if you don't wake up to reality, it could be too late for you Because you could end up losing it all Okay. He has proposed because to you. He Who? proposed. Who? Francis. No. Guess what, girl? Guess what? I met the sweet guy. Damn! Dude is super duper dope. He swept me off my feet. I know you're not drunk. No, I am not drunk. What's going on? Annie, you need to see the guy. I was so vulnerable that I almost lost my breath. Yeah! yeah! He's so sweet. Okay. Um, Julie, I have never seen you this blunt and excited. This guy must be a super. Oh, he is! <laughs> Don't worry. I am going to invite him over 
So that's... You gotta see this. Oh, sh... Oh, girl, you need to see him! <laughs> oh, don't worry. I know you don't understand. <laughs> Let me go in and continue my mini scene. I decided to be the driver for today. Thank oh. you. <laughs> uh, Thank you. Alright. Let me put it over here. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Driver to get ready, we leave at two for the site. And the breakfast, madam? Not hungry. No, oh, madam. Um, madam, that my brother, that my brother is, um, is was going to school, madam, on Sunday. You get your salary today, that's fine. Um, you can also ask him to come by and get some provisions. Oh, madam, madam. Thank you very, very much. God go bless you, madam. Anything for this land where you want, madam. God go give them for you, madam. Thank you, Edith. I'm good, man. does he think he is? Who the hell does he think he is? No. I put myself too low. No. You call me back. Like, no, no. I just got a cup to take this out for lunch. Oh, so many so. I have a very good appointment with my daughter. Still not a problem. You could um, go off and come back for that. No lunch.
It's a lie. You are way outside? No, 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 you, you got to be kidding me. I'm going to outside. Okay, I'm coming right away. Where are we going tomorrow? The company. Which one? I bought you. Okay, ma.
give me a final in time. What is this place then? Okay, um, oh, uh, yeah, uh, my newest project. I was oh. actually uh, building this project for something else. But I think you can have that. Oh my god! <laughs> this is huge! Oh, darling, thank you! Thank you! Come on, come on. Oh, thank you! Hey, come on, it's nothing. Ah, oh, it's nothing. You deserve better than this. Probably you don't know what you've done to me. You put life into me again. Meeting you is like God giving me a second chance to live. Listen. I will love you till the end of time. I want to adore you. I want to cherish you. I love you too. Thank you so much. Oh, uh, alright, alright. Oh, uh, you see, oh, uh, there is an empty land. At the back. That is a place I want to build up. Something like this for the homeless and beggars. Hmm. You're a great man. You have such a good heart. Oh, thanks to God. Hmm? I'm so glad you came into my life. I bless the day I met you. Happy birthday! Oh my goodness! A surprise for you. Oh wow! Thank you, darling. I wasn't expecting this. No, right? Hey, Annie. Oh, happy birthday! Wait, so I was in this house and you guys were putting up all this? I didn't know. Once again, happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> wow, this is good. Yeah. <clears throat> I have something to tell you also. And I believe it's the right time to say it. Really? Yeah. What is it? Promise me you won't get angry. What? Why would I be upset? You love me. Of course. You know that I love you so much. Where will I ever be at the right place, at the right time?
Auntie, please. I already had a bad day. Don't, don't, don't compound it. Please. Oh. Baby boss. Francis, don't you get paid in your place of work? Why is it that each time I talk about money, you either want to forget or you change the topic? Uh, boss, how do we pay our rent? Don't you? I did not say we're not going to pay. Neither did I ever tell you that. I, I don't get paid at my place of work. Besides, when did I start working there? Listen, when they pay me my money, I'll, I'll, I'll bring that money and we'll pay for the rent. Oh, we look all the things we're doing. When they must have thrown us out, right? The land of not throw us out. I don't think he's a very good man. He's not going to throw us out. You think so? Yes, now. <laughs> Francis, you needed to see how long I was taking this man. You needed to see what it took me to beg this man to convince him to leave us. Well, I'm going to have to keep on begging. What? So whenever he comes again, beg him. You allow us to. I don't, I don't have strength to hold this stress. I've been through a lot with you. Hold on, Francis. What are you trying to say? That I have a gift of begging? I'm telling you something now. I've had enough stress today. You're still stressing my life. I don't want to stress my life like I don't want all this rubbish now. Okay, so what do I call you now? A prospective wife. <laughs> Sweetheart, I was never expecting it. Mm. I'm telling you, Miles really surprised me. Who? I thought you said it was love at first sight. I'm just imagining things. Like, I'm going to have my own home, my own man, and say goodbye to the single girls of Association. Okay, so the rest of us should just die. Oh no, come on. Your man was in car. But did you notice Franz was a bit upset? He was upset? Wait. He's not that I got engaged. Well, I don't know. Maybe he was trying to tell you. He has been trying to tell you how he feels about you. But you know that guy loves you. Oh, really? So I shouldn't have embraced the bed at hand and wait for the one in the bush. That's what I'm saying. Anyway, he was not brave enough to see his mind. <clears throat> and he shouldn't make it look like I hurt him. Mm -mm. I didn't hurt him. We were never dating. Do you know? Okay. Well, don't spoil the problem for me, girl. We need to pop some champagne. Because the girl is taken. Bring one. My girlfriend will go find one. We got a money to plan. <laughs> Happy. Hope all is well. Guess what, Ma? Oh, come on. You know, I am not good in guessing. What is it? Uh, Can you please open up? You want to know? You want to know? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, I proposed to her and she accepted. Who? The love of my life. Julie. Today is her birthday and I decided to propose to her and Mom, guess what? She accepted. So and she accepted. Did you yes. tell her about your head condition? Oh, come on, I, I would definitely tell her, but not now. My son, you need to tell her. Eh? So that she will know if she can live with you or not. I know, it's not too necessary, but I would definitely tell her before our wedding day. Ah, my dear, you need to tell her. It's very, very necessary for you to tell her. See, I will not be part of that marriage if you did not tell her about your health condition. And by the way, when is she coming to see me? If I go back? Um, she will come very soon. When she's less busy, I'll bring her to see you. Uh, let her come on Sunday. Alright. <clears throat> uh, Mom, so exhausting. I'm going to bed. Good night, Mom. Can we pray before you go to bed? Oh, uh, uh, Mom, no, I just... I'll pray in my room when I'm sleeping I'll pray inside my hands. Pray for us.
answers. Mm-hmm. Are you checking your time? Look, since you left with flower this morning and came back, you've been this way. You've been looking so sad. Wow. My brother, this life, eh? Ah! This life is not balanced at all, though. At all. Oh, what happened? Huh? Is, is your mother sick again? All right. You saw me the flower, yeah? Yes, I did. That's because today... Today is Julie's birthday. Oh. Oh, yesterday, actually. It's already 12. Ah. I left the house with the flower. Okay. Went out to the supermarket, bought some other things with my hard-earned money. So that I can present it to my my Julie for her birthday. Only for me to get there. And another man was, was I, I, proposing I, to her. Don't say. Uh, you're kidding, right? Like, you're not serious. Did you say... You saw another man proposing to her. I brought I said I saw another man proposing to my dream. Ha! Eh? Wait, who? Did, did she accept the proposal? Did she? My brother, she said yes. Oh. This man even bought her a brand new car. A car? Ah, the difference is clear now. My brother, you went with a flower and someone came with a car. Ah, the difference is clear now. Love now your mates. If now you, which one you could take? Ah, if you had even gone there with a garden, she would have said no. If you had gone there with a farm, <laughs> a car, ah, the difference is clear. Do so you think I'm joking? You're asking me if love is my mate. I don't, I don't understand. I'm telling you something very important that's disturbing me right now. You're, you're asking me. No, 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 my brother, what I'm trying to say is you've been wasting your time. I mean, the young man gifted her with a car. And you carry all the flower go, which I don't say the flower not reach 5k, bros. The difference is clear now. Love not be your mate, my brother. Sometimes more they accept the fact that love not be our mate. All I know is that I'm going to get my Julie back. How? I will fight for what is mine. I will fight. You have started again. You will fight with what? Is it with flower? Somebody that have car. Somebody that could, that could gift a girl with a car. You don't know the kind of weapon where she go, where I go to stay, wait, to fight. What do you want? My brother, leave that battle. You don't lose her. Leave her, leave her, leave her. He who fights and run away lives to fight another day. Just assume say you don't already lose, yeah? And be wait to which kind of car? Z Benz or oh, I know the car will be very expensive. Did you did you test the car? Oh sir. I don't forget enough of you buy her. Ah! My brother not reason her too much. If you had gone there with a garden, nasty lost battle. Ah, oh wow. Your finest no help you out for this one. My brother, it's midnight too. So I don't go inside, go sleep. Oh, if you like, you can sit here. Or probably you want to be hearing the sounds of how the guy is hitting her really hard from behind. Stay to me tomorrow. Just go up. Come on. Try coming, Sammy. You know? doing everything possible to show you what I feel for you. I care for you. I check up on you. I call you all the time. I buy you gifts. Why can't you see that I have something for you? Something very special. Enough of the emotional drama already. We were just friends. If you think because 
because you buy me gifts or because I accept gifts from you means I owe you any form of affection, then you're wrong. We were just friends. What is wrong with you? Look at me. I am in love with you. You are only place in my heart that no one else can take. Just stop. Stop already. I love you. I am not the kind of woman who knows how to share her feelings with two men. To me, it's not too late. Yes, you can share these feelings with me. Please, I, I, I beg you. Francis, please, I do Come on, you don't have to work yourself up because of that smuggle. All you need to do is push through. Well, I'm happy now, Chandy. Mm -hmm. Alright, um. I am going for lunch. I would want you to make sure the person is ready before I come back. I will do that. Hey, let's go. Oh, oh, that reminds me. What is it? You can't just stand there looking at me as if I have done something wrong to you. Can I get paid for half the lot? I don't understand. You want to resign? Yes. Alright. No problem. When will I get half my salary? I'll get back to you. Stupid. 
stupid decision. You're back. Yeah, I'm so cool. Uh -huh. You're back so early today. Yeah. I was able to be happy. So how was what today? What? Work was fine. Um, except that your friend resigned for reasons best known to him. Francis resigned? Yes. Why? I wouldn't know. Maybe you call him and ask him. I don't understand how he expects me to leave miles for him. I knew he would not take him so many miles all the time. But why should he resign? Well, that is not about tea. Yeah, how are you? Um, I need to see you. And it's very urgent. It's important. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Thank you. Um, Francis. It is only a weakling that can close the door of fortune because of a woman. See, if fate wants you and Julie to be together, nothing can stop it, not even you. I mean, why shut the door of your career because of a woman? Why? And I'm very sure you do not understand how I feel. Because if you do, <laughs> you'll be seeing all these things. I cannot get back to that office. Because I do not want to do something that I will regret all my life. Um, do you get it? I do. Okay, why not speak to the man that gave you the job? Let him walk your transfer out. Tell him, oh! Tell him! Tell him! This is the exact thing I've been telling him. Huh? There's no job in this country, and someone finds a job and wants to throw it away just like that, simply because of love. Or, what am I even saying? Love or, or, or one woman? <laughs> I'm not in the mood to start sending words with you today. Go back inside and mind your business now. What's your problem? Bros, am I running any business inside the house? Huh? Right again, now. again, any provision store that they do for there? I will never close my mouth. Please help me tell him. Let him come back to it. He no get sense. As in, now, now which are the sofa since so sense not did this head. Eh? Would you mind yourself? Mind yourself. No, come back and continue talking now. You don't mind your business inside. Can you imagine? Um, I can speak with Julie to re-employ you. Please, please don't even go there. Don't go there. Huh? I, I, I can't go back to that office. I, I don't want to go back there. Okay, I'll, I'll be on the lookout for a job for you. If I see any, I'll definitely let you know. I'll be kind of you. Thank you very much. Just take care of you. Thank I'll call you. Call you again. Joa, sure, take care. Why weren't you at work yesterday? I uh, I was not feeling fine. And today? I resigned, ma. You resigned? Yes. You resigned without telling me? I'm sorry about that. Get into the car. Can you please get into the car? All right, ma'am.
Why did you resign? Personal decision. Personal decision? Personal decision will not put food on your table. It will not pay your bills. Can you please honestly tell me why you resigned? Emotional pressure. What does that even mean? Well, you're a man. Your mother depends on you. Why make her suffer if you can help? I want to apply for a driving job. What? Yes. A commercial driver? No. A company driver, actually. Have you found a place? Yes, I have. Where is that? May Claire Cosmetics. How much is salary? I do not know for now, but I, I'm fine with anything. I'm fine with anything. Good morning, please sit. Um, I'm expecting somebody. He's going to come here looking for the job of a driver. I'll give you his appointment letter and um, every other detail you will need. So when he comes, don't let him into my office. Just give it to him and he'll go. Don't forget, once he resumes, he doesn't have to come to the office. He goes to the garage, picks the truck, takes the goods or whatever to the customer, okay. and then returns the car back to the garage. All right, ma'am. But sorry ma, what was his name? Francis. Okay ma. Don't forget, he doesn't come to the office. Okay ma. Vehicle from the garage to the customer, customers back to the garage. Okay, ma. Thank you. You be ma'am. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Um, I'm here to sign my application for the post of a driver. Oh, you're the one. Yes. Ma Sorry, you don't have to apply anymore. Um, the job is yours, sir. I, I, I'm, I'm sorry, ma'am. I don't understand. Sir, so, my boss instructed me that I should give the job to the first person that comes to the office. You are the first person to come to the office, and you're the lucky person. So, congratulations, sir. Sorry. This is your appointment, sir. Sorry, ma'am. Are you, are, you, are you saying that I already have the job? Yes, sir. <sighs> thank you very much. You're thank welcome, you. Sir. Thank you so much. Congratulations, uh, sir. Is there, is there a way for me to, to go inside and, and, and thank the boss myself? No, no, that will not be necessary, sir. Um, my boss, she's not on seat now. Um, tomorrow, you will start the job. But there's an instruction you, you operate from the factory. And you will come here based on invitation. Okay, okay. That's not a problem. Okay, Thank sir. you very much, madam. Thank you're you. You're welcome. And, and please help me thank the boss, okay? What um, about my CV? Yeah, yes. This is very important for copying and Thank you. Thank you very much. You don't know how this, how much this means to me. Thank you. Please help me thank the boss. All right. Sir. I have to take my leave now, right, so I right. prepare. <laughs> thank you, ma. All right. Bye. Thank you. Hey! Uchi. Enjoy. Man! You can't believe what happened to you today. Ah, okay. I went to the company for the job I told you about. Okay. For the interview. I got there. The receptionist handed over the key to me and told me she was instructed to give me the keys so I could start the job immediately. Bro, no interview, no CV. They just give you a appointment letter. And that's it. Just like that. Just like that. Just like that, oh, Buchi. Imagine. See, my guy, Francis, you're lucky. Oh. <laughs> you are. Again. In fact, you're not just lucky. God loves you. Just like that. You can say that again. I don't know what I've done for God to love me so much like this. <laughs> 
That's the thing. Though. You know, the God we serve is a merciful God. Oh, yes. And yes, but my problem yes. with you, I just hope you are not going there again to fall in love. You know, you and this, your emotional breakdown issues. Please stop saying this. Just saying. It's all right. I'll just go there and walk. Yeah, better. Huh? It's better you go there and walk. Yes. Please. I'm happy for you. Congrats on my guy. Ha -ha. It's very rare, this country now. Uh, yes, I know. But I hope my, my, my own food is inside the pot. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. We are very hungry right now. I did not cook, bros. So where, where did you get this one? Bros, I got this one on the wheel. Are you okay. serious? It smells really nice, oh. Ah, come on. Ah, I can't be inside the water and then soup will enter my eye. Let me enjoy myself with you, my brother, huh? <laughs> Man, I when can't. Are you Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes, yeah, so. Ah. I've started already. Yeah, you need to love you. Ah. I'm fine. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my son. How are you? I'm fine. Mama. At least offer us a seat. Oh my god. Okay. F is the right, I'll yes. tell you. <laughs> Meet Miles, my husband to be. Your husband to be? Yes, Mama. You're welcome, my son. Thank you very much. As a matter of fact, we are here for the marriage list. Marriage list? Yes, Mama. So sorry. <laughs> That's how he wants it to. He'll be going to Scotland for his PhD, so he wants us to do everything before he leaves. Yes. Let me see. He's not going to be able to get married. Mama, he's been traveling to overseas and coming back since he was a child. Yeah. Jimmy, you are speaking English. You are speaking English. This man with Obodo Ibo abroad. Eh? Are you sure he's not rushing back to meet his first wife? <laughs> Mama, hmm? he has never been married. And so far, he's been honest. Mm. Are you sure? I'm sure. Okay. That has been my prayer for you all these years. I'm ready to get married to a very good man who take good care of you. It has been my prayer. If you say you like him, you love him. I have no objection. It is my concern, my dear. I'm happy for you. <laughs> I'm happy for you. Thank you, Mama. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Sit down. You are welcome again. Thank you. You are welcome, my son. Thank you, man. Fine man. <laughs> you are welcome, bro. Let me go inside then. I'm prepare something for you to eat. Come on, don't worry. Oh. We'll eat something for coming. 
Ah, really? Okay. Just help us get the marriage list and we'll be here on Sunday to pick it up. Hi! <laughs> Don't forget to tell your uncles as well. Oh, yes, sure. I'll tell them. Okay. But for now, we would have to be on our way. Really? Yes. I have a lot of things to do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Save Johnny, oh? Save Johnny. Take care of my daughter. Mm -hmm. Take of care of my daughter. Uh -huh. 100. Mm -hmm. 100. <laughs> <laughs> Take care of yourself. Yes, I will. I will. I will. I will. Hi. Nemo. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, young man. Take care of my daughter. Thank you very much. Oh, save Johnny. Oh. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Hey! Fine, man. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye, oh! Uh -huh. uh, bye bye, bye bye, bye bye. Mm -hmm. Hello, Joy. For me to see her. How? Mom, I already told you. I told you she's a busy woman, so whenever she's less busy, I will bring her for you to see. Oh, she's a busy person. Yes. For her to come and see her mother in law, you are telling me that she is a busy person. You know, I will not support that wedding if you did not do the right thing. You know that? I know, Mom. We will do the right thing. I will let her know, so she must come see you for the wedding. Then bring her. Okay. I will. Thank you, Mama. Good afternoon, ma'am. 
Good afternoon, my dear. You're welcome. Thank you, ma. Finally, here is the woman you've been waiting for. Her name is Jill. Hmm. I thought as much. My daughter, you are blessed. Thank you, my Thank you. So, how about your parents? My mom is fine. Ah, really? You're welcome once again. Ah, Miles. Can I have a word with you? Okay. We'll be back. Tell her everything she needs to know before we go and see her people. Mom, please, please. That can't wait. Don't worry, I will tell her myself. Oh, my son, there is no time. You have just one month, one month to live. You can't bring her and imprison her here. You need to tell her everything. Mom, oh, there is no first. No problem, Mom, fine, no problem. Can we just go and give her food to eat or drink? Please. Then watch what I will do. Oh, no, no, don't you, don't do anything. Ah, my daughter, I am a very open person and I'm also a believer. I will not want my son to ruin your life. Oh, 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 mom, stop, stop. Oh, yes, I already told her everything she needs to know. Really? Yes. And what, what did you tell her? Oh, everything about me. I told her everything about me, everything about my family. You told her everything about you? Yes. Did you tell her about your health issues? Did you also tell her that you have been battling with cancer of the brain? No, open up. Open up to her. Oh, Mom, please, please, please stop. I am the one that is going to get married to her. Please allow me to tell her everything she needs to know so she will understand. So you are going to put gold or silver in your mouth before you tell her, okay? Huh? I love Miles so much. And his health issues cannot stop me from loving and marrying him. We can help him with our prayers. <clears throat> can I ask you one question? When last did you pray? Sorry, I didn't tell you this earlier. I was waiting for the right time. Please, no woman has ever loved me in the way you love me. Please don't leave me. Please. Oh, no. I cannot be a 
widow at an early age. you see that you are doing yourself more harm? Stay away from me. Stay away from me. You are the cause of my problem. I'm the real cause of this. Listen, if I sleep tonight, that you wake up. You'll be held responsible for everything that happens. Can you please stop? What is all this? Where are you going to? Buchi, you won't believe it. Julie just called me to come now. Julie? Yes. She, she just called me. Uh, so so what, what does she want? I, I don't know. She was sounding so uh, urgent over the phone. Yes. Oh, so I, I need to go and see her now. Okay. So so hold on. Because she was sounding so urgent on the phone. You are rushing to go see her. Of course now. You are supposed to know now. You know what? What about her own lover? I don't know. Maybe she has changed her mind and she wants me back. So <laughs> let, let me go and see her. Francis, permit me to say this. You are very stupid. Thank you very much. Thank you. I know I'm stupid. Thank you. And um, um, I cannot see your truck. Where did you park your truck? I parked it somewhere now. So, <laughs> Please, you are wasting my time. I, I, I don't have time. I'm in a hurry. Let me go and see. Oh, stop. Did you go? I'll see you later when I come back. Talk to me, Julie. 
और ही दूसरी है चुनी सच अपन के साथ वॉच आई सेट सच अपन के साथ Listen to me. If he hurts you, trust me, I will. I'll take this up. Something wrong. Are you sure she's not suffering from some mental disorder? But she's testing my love. What kind of thing is this? Where I park. This is where I park my truck now. Hey! No, 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 no. I, 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 I came in. I, I, I know this is, this is you. Exactly here and here. I, 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 I parked the motor like this. Bros, bros, I beg, wait. Okay, I'm, I'm very sorry for disturbing you. But I, I, I park my truck here. I park my company truck here. This is where I, I, I I, I I parked it here and, and went there to, to to see somebody and okay you see my truck. Oh I did not see anything. Hi! Hi! Wait. Ah. I, I, it's, it's here now. This is this is where where I I I I, I, I parked the truck. I I I I I I I put put it. Come on, come on, come on, sorry. Hey, be cool, eh? Did you see see a company truck I parked here? I parked my truck here and now I don't understand. I, am I on the wrong street? Huh? Did you see one co company truck that was parked here? Two partners like that. They carry a commodity. Oga? Wait, you, you see my truck? Oga? Oga, where my truck I beg? Oga, where, Oga, where the truck? Where the truck? The truck. It belongs to the company, please. The company where they work. Uh, now they talk, so say two fat men, then carry and come out. Hey, two, two, two fat men? Eh? Wait, 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 where they carry and go, Oga? Then carry and they go like this. Hey! Oga, wait, wait, you, 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 but you know them? You know them? No, I didn't have them before. Hey, my truck. My truck, Oga, 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 please, please, come on, come on, come on. Hey! My truck! <laughs> Which I'm dead. I'm finished. Oh. I'm dead. Tell me now, is Julie all right? Which I'm finished. I'm, I'm finished. My own has finished in this world. My own has finished. Oh, which I, I just want to go and jump beside you, Babinui, now, please, Uchi. My, my friend, stop this now. You know that Rabinu is very far from here. Hey. Talk to me. Did anyone die? Buchi, I'm the one who's going to die now. Eh? I'm the one who's going to die now, Buchi. I'm finished. What, what, what hey. happened? You, you, Francis, stop being dramatic now. Talk to me. What happened? Buchi, I'll tell you. 
Okay. I went to see Julie. Okay. Julie refused to talk to me. I, 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 I tried to talk to this girl. I don't, I don't know. So, don't know so, I so, mean. so. Uh -huh. I, I, I was confused. I, I, I got somewhere. I, I packed the truck and then tried to relax somewhere to get myself because I was, I was, I was running mad. Julie refused to talk to me. You understand? So when I got myself, I, I, I decided to go back to the office. I went back to where I parked the truck. I couldn't find it again. I couldn't find the whole truck. How do I explain this? Eh? What, 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 do I, what do I tell people? Wait, 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 Francis, wait. wait, wait. See, 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 guy, we need to wake up from this dream together. You mean the, the van has been stolen? Are you not listening to me? I just, I just made it clear to you now that the van is missing. It has been stolen. Eh? Hey. As I'm talking to you, I know, I know my village people have remembered me now. They think I'm, they, they, they think I've made money. Well, which village eh? people? Because I'm driving truck. Francis, will you stop? This has nothing to do with your village people, but your stupidity. Francis, I've been telling you, I've warned you sternly about this girl. This Julia of a girl, but you wouldn't listen. Now, just, just imagine. What, what will you tell the company? No, what will, what will you, that you packed a van and you did not see it? I, I, I don't know what to do now. I don't. I don't know what I'll tell them. What, you, do, what do you think I should do now? Just tell me. What do you, what do you advise me to do? Eh? What do you advise me? Look, Francis. The only thing left for you now is to go to a nearest police station and, uh, and give a report. You tell them exactly what happened, and then you can call your company and probably explain to them that I don't know how the van got missing. I don't know, but you can. That, that's just the only option left for you now. You're, you're correct. Yeah, that's uh, what wait, you do now. Wait, uh, come on, come on, escort me. Let's no, go. no, 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 no. If, if, if two of us go, it becomes a crowd. This is personal issue, my brother. You need to go there and face the police. Well, after the police is your friend, and they, they keep on saying this. They are our friends, so, but now you need to go there alone and tell them exactly after I wasn't there where this thing happened, now, my brother. Don't involve me, John, all this story now. Just. But, but you know, I'm still, having, I'm still having trauma right now. I need you to to help me so that when I'm talking and writing statements, you, you you assess what I'm saying and writing so that I'll not make mistakes and write. No, 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 Francis. <laughs> Another mad reach that point. Me, me escort you go police station. No, my brother, just go there and carry your cross. After I've been warning you about this same Julie girl. Eh? So you not escort me to the police station? Am I mad? Go, go there to do what? Hey. See, my brother, you have to carry your cross yourself. After I've been warning you about this Julie of a girl, don't just stand here now, Francis. You walk to the nearest police station. Oh, okay, okay. But you just, just give me the address of where the Babenwe is. Let me go and jump inside. I think that one is better for me. Let me commit suicide now. Instead of going to the police station, I, I, I will report myself and they will arrest me. I say I'm going to sell, sell, sell their truck and then. I, I... Listen, my brother. I'd rather give you the address of River Benway than to follow you to any police station. You see, my writing on the fine for statement too. Just River Benway is even better safe. At least they will know you 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 are you, you died as a hero. It's better, my brother. Even, even if you die in that river safe, your, your corpse will not smell. Yes, it's even better than to go and stalk in all of, all of those uh, police cells, those jails. River Benway is better. Maybe I think I'll give you the address. 17 area keke can take you there.
Did you go to the place? Okay, but this, you, you came so early, I, that, that's why I'm confused. Back from where? Do I even know where I'm going to? I don't know where I'm going to again, I'm just confused. Walking... It's like I'll go there tomorrow. Yes. It's better for me to go there tomorrow. Let me use today to, to settle myself and make plans just in case. Listen, Buche, if I go there tomorrow and and I don't come back, just help me explain to my mother what happened. Explain to her so she will know I'm not a thief or an arm robber. Huh? Please. She'll be wondering why the police people arrested me. Seriously, I'm, I'm feeling for that woman. No? Uh, Bobo, in this your case, eh? See, no, no, be said to follow you go to that police station now in the uh, ad meal. Now, because of say, I'll be orphan. Hey, eh, Bobo, in this case now, the only person that can that can save you from this situation is that woman that helped you with the driving job. Yes, she's the only person that can save you now from this. How do I even face her? No, tell me, how do I face her? The last time I saw her, she was telling me sweet, sweet things, and I was telling her bitter, bitter things. No, how, how do I even face her now? Francis. It's not fair now. Francis. It's not fair. What are you talking about? Wait, wait, wait. This thing, has it got into your head already? I'm sure, I'm, I'm sure it has got into my head. No, no, I'm sure, because normally, is this how I used to behave? Is this how I used to talk? No, no, tell me now. Is this how normal people behave? I've been walking everywhere. You know, look, Francis, I, I understand you. Huh? I, I really know exactly what you're going through right now. Bobo, I think you should you should stay focused and just be head straight. You talking too much will not make you even think straight for once. I don't understand. What do you mean by staying focused? I mean, how is there any level of focus now that I can be on to see that truck? You said you should be thinking. How straight can I think now to to find the truck? I don't understand now. What what do you mean by that? I should be thinking straight. All the things that I've been thinking, do you know how they're affecting my brain now? I don't even know what I'm thinking again. I don't even know what I'm doing. I should be praying so I don't run mad. You see, 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 see how I've been walking under the sun, up and down, round everywhere. I'm looking for talk on that on, 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 inside gutter. What, what kind of thing is that now? Let me go and eat first. In case they arrest me tomorrow. How do I even talk to her? What do I, what do I tell her? Okay. Um, uh, good afternoon, ma. I... I was driving the truck and then... I don't know what happened, I disappeared. Ah... Uh, that's stupid. I, I was I was I was driving the truck and then I I was double crossed by by armed robbers yes and they collected my I don't have strength to enjoy myself now because I have to enjoy myself to show proof yes now I have to show proof come on now wound myself Spoil my skin. <sighs> okay. I parked the truck on the road. I I tried to buy something. And before I found the collector. Let me go there. You can't tell on my hand. How? Why? What do you mean? What do you mean stolen? You see, while I was driving, I felt so pressed, so I I stopped to to use the bush. 
by the time I came out, the, the truck was nowhere to be found. I, I checked everywhere. I, I couldn't find it, so I reported to the police. How could you be this careless? Why didn't you lock the truck? I never knew this would happen. Yes. Terry, please. I, I, I want you to help me beg, beg the owner of the truck. Okay, help me beg him uh, to give me some time so I could at least sell the only piece of land I, I got from my father to replace the money. Please. That's fine, Francis. You, you don't have to sell the only thing your father left you. I'll sort this out. But first, you have to write an apology letter acknowledging your carelessness in this. What? You do this for me? Listen, just, just like write the letter first and then I'll, we'll pick up from there. I'll, I'll, I'll sort it out. Yes, I'll, I'll, I'll write the letter. Thank you so much. It's nothing, it's, it's fine. Thank you so much. Sorry, please excuse me. <laughs> yes. Uh... What? Mama. Uh, uh, oh, okay. I'll 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 meet you guys soon. Yes, I'll be there soon. <sighs> what is it? Mama, I see. I I need to get to the house. I'll drop you. Thank you very much. I need to. I need to go now. Malaria, typhoid, chest pain, waist pain, everything. Why didn't you take her to the hospital now? But I did, but I don't have any money, so the doctor sent us back. <laughs> quick, quick, quick. Let's, let's take her to the hospital. Quick, 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 quick. Oh. Mama, sorry. Oh. 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 Sorry, okay? Oh. Sorry, let's oh. try, try, try. Stand. Oh. My daughter, I want to thank you. I want to thank you so much. As you can see, I'm doing well now. Way better. I'm so happy to see you. The doctor said, I am fine. I am good to go. From the depth of my heart, I say thank you. It's nothing good. May God in heaven bless you. <laughs> my dear, whatever you brought this money you spent on me, my father in heaven will replenish it for you in me long forward. Amen. God bless Amen. you. I'm happy you're better. Ah. <laughs> uh, see, some angels are living with us on earth, <laughs> and you are one of them. <laughs> oh, where? Yes, I'm telling you. Thank you, Mama. I'm happy you're better. God bless you. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Yes. You, you never told me you... Um, Mama, just come inside.
Welcome, madam. Sorry, Mama. Thank you. God bless you for me. Amen. Ah, I almost died yesterday. In fact, I was at the point of death when God brought you to save me. Saved your life. It was God that saved your life. Through you. God bless you, my daughter. Amen. God bless you. Amen. Hi. Um, Mama, would you want something to drink before the food is ready? Let me wait for the food. Huh? Very well, Mama. Uh -huh. Mama, so I have told my doctor to call your doctor so he can follow up with you. And don't worry about the cost. I'll foot the entire bill. Try. Ah, but you have done enough already. Mama, enough is never enough once a life is concerned. Fine. I want to see a stronger you when next I visit. By the grace of God, I promise I'll be stronger when next to see me. That's exactly what I want to hear. <laughs> Thank you. God bless you. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Mama, please. It's okay. It's our hand over. Mm -hmm. Wait up. What would you want to have for lunch, Mama? Uh, anything delicious. Fine. I don't want to bother you. Well, you have to pick something. Because we have everything in this house. So pick what you want and I'm certain that eat it is equal to the task. Even if it's fufu. You have everything in this house? <laughs> yes. Chai. Okay, in that case, I will eat in salad and I will... Okay. Uh -huh. Eat it. Madam. Make it with fresh fish. Oh, madam. Chai. <laughs> How did you know I love, love fresh fish? Oh, so you do. This girl, you love fish. <laughs> God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Bless you. Chai. I have sent them to you. Yes, I have sent them to you. Finish them all. Do not tell me you cannot sell. So finish everything that I have sent to you. I have them in bundles, so I have sent them to you. Oh? Uh. <laughs> what is it? What is it? Talk to me. <laughs> oh, Ginny, what is it? <laughs> yes, go on, speak. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. What 
is not good. Is man's all right? <laughs> he's almost all right. He's almost all right. What do you mean by that? <laughs> what do you mean by that? I would I find myself in this kind of a terrible situation. <laughs> Talk to me. What the what is the matter? What's the problem? <laughs> what is the problem? You have started again. What is the problem? Talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> Stop this crying. Please. We have been sitting down here for the past two hours. You are not saying anything. You are not talking. All you do is this tears that I'm saying. Has a young man changed his mind? Yeah. Thank God you're heavy. For the past two hours we have been sitting down here. Julie is not saying anything. All you see is these tears. Please, help me to ask her. What the problem is, let her tell me something. Yes, my daughter. What is it? Yeah. Hmm. She is still not talking. Are you sure they have not used her brain for money ritual? Nobody can use her brain for money ritual. Nobody. Hmm? Um. No. Adeje Jemba. Can you talk to your uncle? I'm here for you. <laughs> Did you have any problem with your man? Did he say anything bad to you? Or his mother said anything bad to you? <laughs> please, please, follow her. Follow her quickly before she hurt herself. Eh? To your mother is not fair. It is not fair. Tell me what the problem is. And let me do what I think I can do. Biko. Biko. Talk to me. Hey. Talk to me. Talk. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit, sit. Hmm? Talk to me. I am your mother. Please. Biko. Continue. Yes, you will marry me. What are you trying to tell me? God has put salt into your matter. You want to spit it out? How? You told me that this man wanted to build a house in your name. And what are you, what rubbish are you saying? Hey, don't say it again. You don't understand. I don't want to understand. I don't want to understand anything at all. <laughs> Julie, your brothers are in the university. This man is a wealthy man, so hook up! And so, so that things will be less not you. Biko! Mama, he has a short life! Then give him a song. Yes. Give him a song. When you give him a song, the wealth becomes yours. 
Where is your go kind of You are looking at me. What are you talking about? Mama? There is absolutely no way I am going to let you push me into doing something I will regret in future. Yeah, I won't do it. it. You have just started. You have just started. He has a short life. Give him a son so that the world belongs to you. And I sing him. So you want to tell people now that I didn't that I didn't bring you up well? You want to put shame on my face? Okay? No, let me know. Tell me. You want to put shame on my face? Man, man, me. Just arrange yourself. Give him a song. And let the word come. I don't want to hear anything. Yes, she is at the back of the house with your mother. Okay, sir. Yeah. Oh, let me... Julian, I know you may want to hear me and talk to him. Or see me remind you. All I want to tell you is I love you with every fiber in me. All I always wanted is to look and cherish you. I want to spend my life with you till the end of time. I love you very much. I said my eyes on you. You give me more strength to leave me here, even with my my situation. <laughs> <laughs> mother must have told her something bad. Well, thank God it ended in peace. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I'll take my leave. Eh? Okay. Thank you. She mean by short life. Yeah. And all this girl has not been visiting native doctors. Well, there's a way. Yeah, um, this is another project. It's actually a multi-millionaire project. Actually building a hospital. Okay. 
But why are you showing me all this? I mean, you took me to the other project where you're building a five-star hotel and now to a place you're building a hospital. Why are you showing me all these places? Because you will need them. You will need them after I have gone. Oh, no. Don't say that. I wish I... I wish I don't have to say it. But it's the truth. It's okay. Please, stop it. Alright? Please, please, please. Please, please. Please stop this. Please. so much. Sisters. No. Please don't say that. You're hurting me. Please. Just grant me this request. Ma, I have come to tell you that I have chosen to share in your son's pain. If marrying him will be his last wish, then I'll grant it. My daughter, you don't have to do this. I have made up my mind. I will grant his request. And what could that be?
why I take my last breath. My daughter, I have seen the love you have for my son. It's undreamed of. I wish you both love and peace in this little time. Tell me you were coming home. Oh yes, I know I did. I didn't tell you, but I saw your wedding post on Instagram, so I didn't want to miss out or anything. So when is the date? It's, uh, on Saturday. On Saturday. Yo, oh, thank God you're home. Automatically, that makes you my best man. Ah, uh, just like that. Just like that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're welcome. Oh, oh, my bad. Oh, sorry. My fiance, my wife to be. Oh, her name is Juliet. Wow. Yeah, uh, Juliet, my younger brother, my stubborn younger brother, best. Uh, she's really beautiful. All right, uh, you're welcome. Uh, I was about seeing her off, so I'll be right back. Why do you want her to leave? She can at least sleep over and then go to my mom. Mom is oh. around. Yeah, mom. <laughs> All right, so I'll be in there waiting. Eh? Better right. go and meet mom. No do take care of her. Eh? I'll be right back. Yeah, Don't worry. You can go in and just with your brother. I'm fine. I don't think she wants to marry you because she loves you. Yes, because she knows how much she's going to be worth if she finally marries you. And then when you're gone, you know how this break your skin. I know. I know we have so many desperate girls out there. Daughters of Jezebel everywhere. Blood sucking demon girls everywhere. But you see this? She's none of them. She's a good girl. She has a good heart. Trust me. So when did you meet her? Uh, a few weeks ago. A few weeks ago? Yes. And you've concluded that she is in love with you? Exactly. Big bro, I expect you to know better. Come on, come on, come on. Stop making me feel like I don't know what I'm doing. I know that girl. That girl is an angel in human form. Hmm. Trust me. If you ask for my honest opinion, okay. I will tell you that that girl does not love you. Come on, come on. Mom can testify to that. Oh, uh, little brother, I understand you're trying to watch my back, huh? But don't worry, everything will be fine. She's a good girl. Okay, it's all right. Um, mm -hmm. I'll support you. Oh, come on, <laughs> come on. That is what I want to hear from you. No, I'll stay. Uh, all right, I'll be fine. <laughs> I'll be fine. <laughs> uh, uh, so, so, so tell me. I don't understand. What is going on? Uh, I've got your back anytime, anytime. All right. Bro.
I came to ask you a question. I'm out here. I heard you get married to him. Yes, tomorrow. Do you have any problem with that? Are you marrying him because you love him now? Is it his money? You already know the truth. Nobody wants to be in second class cities in forever. Really? Wow. Now that you've confirmed it, can I lock the door? I was offered a job in the office. A position, actually. So I was thinking, did you resign or I wanted to replace you behind you? Think no more, because I am going to become a CEO soon. Can I lock my door? Are you asking me out of your house? You know what? It is obvious you are not ready to leave, so when you are done, lock the door behind you. There's nothing wrong with loving someone, but it's terrible when you love the wrong one. Your heart and emotions will be tied with, yes it will, your decisions and actions will be affected negatively, you'll be manipulated. Oh, and taking advantage of yeah. Why would she be so nice? You you, I know she loves me. But she's doing all of this because of me. God, please. Just bless me with money. I need money. Plenty of money. I'm not fine. I'm not fine. I thought you would move on. How am I supposed to move on when my heart is somewhere else? How? Can't I have told you this before? This life will save you sweet and bitter. But we have to take it all and enjoy it. When am I going to enjoy the sweet part of this life? Tell me, when? Very soon. After the sun comes the rain. Just calm down. Everything will be fine. Please. That you will regret if you don't wake up to reality. It could be too late for you. Because you could end up losing it all. Losing it all. It's the best thing, it's the best thing to do if you love the one who doesn't love you more. Mom, I don't like her. Do you really want to? Not at all. But through her actions, I come to realize she is from a good home. From her actions. From her actions. Why is it amongst everyone in this house that I am the only one seeing that this girl is after my money? Why? My dear, as far as my loves her and she loves him, I'm okay with it, you know. Mom, you're talking about love. You're still talking about love. Mom, have you seen a girl in her class? ever fall in love for a poor guy. Mom, this lady is out to reap where she did not sow. Can't you see, mother? She wants to reap where she did not sow. Son, let God judge. 
And I don't want to talk about this again. It will make me think Miles will die tomorrow. Please, I don't want to talk about it anymore. What am I gonna do? What have I done to myself? Done to myself. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. See what I've done to myself. Done to myself. Francis, yes. You you're crying. Wait 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 wait, Francis. Don't tell me you have been this way since morning. This was the exact point I left you when I was going for work. <sighs> Today is a very bad day for me. Oh my God. Is, is your mother okay? Francis, talk now. Is Mama okay? Julie. Julie got married today. Julie got married. Did you hear what I just said? Look, I decided not to give you audience for rubbish. Ah, Francis, what am I asking you? Where are you good guesses? Money may go cut your hair. It makes sense they enter your head. God bless him now, the sense now they enter your head because of this hair. But why are you so heartless? Why are you this mean? That if I slap you. No, I will just need to slap you one day, may your sense come back to normal. After all, they'll come meeting for us say two ten and fight. <laughs> what have I done to myself? I don't blame you. I blame your upbringing. Get Terry tonight. It's our wedding night. I mean, our honeymoon just got started. So, let's enjoy it to the fullest. And now, let me see how your mom is going to come knock on the door to tell us that we are covering for the patient. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, let me go take a shower. So I'm going to go to the other side. Wait. So you are going to actually go take your shower alone? Can't you see I am actually waiting for you? So now we can hop into the shower together. Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, you know, all right. let me just turn on the heater. Okay. Take 
Get up, honey, and take off your clothes. Honey, get up and take off your clothes. Honey, eat. Honey, get up. Honey. This place, I beg you, stay with what I have. Doctor, doctor, please, I beg you. You know how I've been on this case for the past few years. It was discovered really. Oh my God. Ah, oh, my God. That's my brother's wife. He just got married yesterday. No, I'm to be honest with you. I have to be honest with you. I have to be honest with you. Is my brother dead? Doctor, talk to me. Is my brother dead? I'm sorry. We did able to. Came to the theater. To the theater? Yes. Uh, why? What happened? Please. Oh, please. Can I pray for him? Please. Oh, mother, you don't have much time for him. You have to go. Doctor, we want to pray for him. What, what do you to pray to God? I said I want to pray for my son, and you are telling me that you don't have time. Mother, this will take me back to the hospital. Sorry? This will take me back to the hospital. It cannot escalate anything, Doctor. We just want to. Person they find you for outside. Who is that? Oga Prince. Francis. Yes, madam. Let him in. To madam. Please sit, you can go. Thank you very much. Hi, Francis. I'm fine. <laughs> so, um, work, yes, how is the new job going now? Well, it's going very fine. My last experience with the company is a good teacher. <laughs> awesome. Thank you very much. And your, your mom, I mean, how is your mom? Oh yes, I spoke to her today before going to work. She's very fine. Oh, awesome. Great. Hmm. Good. Ma'am, I came to thank you for everything you've been doing for me. Um, I'm truly sorry for I've been keeping my distance because I do not know if I will live up to your expectations as a lover. Yes. Francis. 
Sip it me. Come on. Really? You should. That hurts. I mean, it's. <laughs> it's. Oh, yes, it does. So you should. Sit here. I mean, it's just for a couple of minutes. It's. All right. Okay. Um. Better. I'm fine. <laughs> Francis. If I did not feel anything for you, I wouldn't say I I feel something when I did, don't or didn't I, I'm sorry. I like you. I I do feel something for you. I don't know. And I feel like it's best I tell you how I feel. So I like you. You know, it's obvious that no woman except my mother has loved and cared for me the way you do. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. It's nothing. So... I was thinking... of going to the room upstairs to wait for you. <laughs> so that, that's not a bad idea. Okay, so I should go up? Yes. <laughs> so I'm going up. I will meet you upstairs. Thank you. Yes. back to work now. Oh yes, um, I have to to get to work. <laughs> so I have a little something for you. Oh, it's small, but I guess you can manage it. Darling, this is this is too much. Listen, you're mine now. Anything that makes you happy is just. What I'm going to do. Thank you so much for all, for everything you do for me. Do I deserve all those good things? I'm more. Uh, so what? Yes, but I promise you I'll be here as soon as I'm done. Promise. Of course I promise. Now it's because if you don't come, I'll come there and be good myself. Hey. I cross my heart. I'll be here as soon as I'm done. Okay? Awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Please, <laughs> are we from here? We are leaving this hospital. <laughs> Why? Why are we leaving this place? They Why? Are, they are moving him to another hospital. Moving him to another hospital? Yes. Why are they moving him to another hospital? Why? If you people don't want to join me, let's go. Then you people will remain here while I leave. Bet! What is going on here? Huh? Why are you being unnecessarily harsh to me this 
morning. Ha, what is going on? I am not taking you to any hospital. Best, I don't want to be angry with you. Do you hear me? I, am, I have taken enough of this your rubbish. Please come and take me to the hospital where my son is, was transferred to. Mom, you want me to take you to the hospital so you continue your prayers. And Mom, Mom, you want me to take you to the hospital so that you will continue your prayers instead of letting Mars have his medical attention. Mom, I won't stop and I will never stop blaming you for Mars's condition. If you had told us earlier, maybe we could have helped him. But all you did was to pray for him even when he needed medical attention, Mom. Best, I am trying so hard to respect you as my brother-in-law. Can you please take us to the hospital where he was transferred to? Yeah. We need to see him and know how the surgery went. Please, let's go. You are still wasting time, Best. There, there is... There is no hospital. Excuse me? What do you mean? My... My brother... Mads... Is dead. What? 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 Mars... Mars... <coughs> Mars is dead. Mars is dead. Sorry about the death of your brother. 
I'm really sorry about that. Was it an accident? What did I just hear you say? You know, he was all lively yesterday during the wedding reception. How come all of a sudden he died just like that? I will not take your coming here to be an act of ignorance. Know you fully well that your friend married my brother because of his wealth, even when she knows that he was going to die soon. Excuse me? You're quite excused. What is going on? You don't understand. You don't understand what is going on here. Hmm? Your friend thinks that she's very smart. That she can come into my home and take all that my brother labored for and I will sit and fold my hands. Hmm? <coughs> so listen. See that game that she thinks that she knows how to play? I will play it better. Tell her that she's joking. I will sit here and watch her take everything that my brother labored for. I need to go and tell my husband what has just happened. Please, I'm coming. My husband's house. Is he, is, he, is he your tradition or something? I have tried so long, so much, to avoid you. I have tried my best to avoid you. Oh, but Caesar, I cannot. Then I'll have to face you. Since it is in your people's tradition to reap where they did not sow. Excuse me? I will spell it out to you. You are a gold digger! What? And you just have 10 minutes to leave this house. Or you think I don't know? You think you can deceive us all with your crocodile tears? You think I don't know that you agreed to marry my brother because he showed all of his establishments? You think that we don't know that the reason why you married him? It's because of all he has. And you're here. Waiting to take all of this. You just have 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Unless I forget. You see that card there? You are not going with it. You are leaving it behind. I have told you, you are not living with that car. Best. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. 
ด้วยWaiting for the right time. Please. No woman has ever loved me the way you love me. Please don't leave me. Ask me to shut up and leave her house. He insulted me in the presence of our friend. Mm. You said your daughter Juliet, yeah, send me out from my house. Why? Why should she do that? Well, I sense that something is from somewhere. Yes. My enemies have remembered me. They have... They have turned away the face of my daughter with Juju. Now that she has made money, they want me to suffer. These people want me to suffer. Madam, well, it's not issue of value. You said your enemy has turned your daughter's face from you. Exactly. Now, I knew that you wanted your daughter to yes. be to marry that young man because of his money. But listen, I was told that the young man has terminal disease and he knew he was going to die young. He had come back here with the money. Is it not all of us that will enjoy it? Will you not eat from it? Will I not give to you? My friend, then it's you. Money, 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 money. Eh? Money has been existing before you were born on earth. But if it is your wish, I have given up on you from today. Eh? 
You don't even care about the welfare of your daughter all the time. Money, 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 money. Money have been, have been in existence before you have been born to this earth. Money, 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 money. I don't blame you. It's not your fault. Look at the way she's even talking. Money, 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 money. You don't even have strength because you don't have money. If she had come to this house with the money, you would have enjoyed from it. I know you are very hungry. That's why you are talking now. You are shaking. It's not your fault. I don't blame you. It's not your fault at all. Money, money, money. Without money, can you breathe? Are you free? Are you free? Yeah. Mm. Is it sweet? Yeah, I'm sure it's sweet. You said you've tried it before. <laughs> uh, hold on, darling. Are you scared? Yeah. Is it sweet? So, um. I know you guys can wait, so let's um, toast to love. To love, to friendship. Hey, what about the love. Cheers. Cheers, darling. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's sweet. It's kind of like great. Like great. Yeah. What? 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 <laughs> Nothing. Gucci, it's nice, actually. you are looking at him, he is looking at you. That's why we're friends. No, <laughs> talking eyes. I'm seeing it. Darling. Mm-hmm. You know I love you so much. Yeah, I know I love you too. And so I want to take this to the next level. Yeah. Yeah, darling. Marry me. Be my wife. The mother of my unborn kid. And please don't say no. I wouldn't even dare. Like, I knew you! <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, I knew because you... I, I get, yes. She said, yes. <laughs> <laughs> because what? I saw the sign, I guess. <laughs> Congratulations, my man. Yes, <laughs> man. I knew with you looking at him. Uh, <laughs> oh. oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. Love it. I'm glad you like it. I do. You. <laughs> you. <laughs> I knew. Thank you very much. Hey, bro. come on. You didn't tell me you have such money. Ah, I'm just... What are you saying? She means the world to me. Well, you can say that again, bro. <laughs> Mucci. <laughs> ah. Nice. I think it's about time you moved in. Well, I was thinking it's about time I go see your parents maybe next week. No. You're serious? Of course I am. I think I'm ready to get married. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Yes, 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 Say yes, it again. Yes. I am ready to get married. What? Yes. No, say it again. I've thought about it. Oh my god, we are in for some serious business! <laughs> Mama. Hey, Mama. <laughs> I go there. Mama. No. Oh. Hey. Let's go, Mama. Mama. Mm. Hey. Do you know what? <laughs> Do you know that? Since today, my mind has been telling me that I'm going to see you. I'm going to see you. <laughs> Here I am. <laughs> it's good to see you, Mama. Hi, Sam. Mm. Here. Oh, Mama. Mm. Kaiba <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Uh, let me bring it. Okay, Mama. Okay. Hey, oh. <laughs> Mama is always like that. It's the air. Yes, that's what it gets in the village. Wow, love fresh it. air. Mm. Where's your brother? 
You should be around somewhere. Mm. Come on, let me help. Hey, hey, hey. Thank you, Mama. Mama, sit now. Sit, 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 sit. Welcome. Thank you, Mama. I'm so happy to see both of you. Oh, Mama. Eh? How are you now? My dear, as you can see, I'm strong and well. Hey! My daughter. I have not stopped praying for you. You're such a wonderful girl with a heart of gold. Thank you, Mama. God will not stop blessing you in this mm. life. You must be blessed in this life. Mm. Chai. Mom. I'm extremely happy that you've recovered fully, Mama. All thanks to you. Hi. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you. Do you know what? <laughs> Since morning, my instincts was telling me that you will come. I went to the market. I bought this. I prepare delicious soup. Ah, I think we're hungry, yeah. Thank you. I know you're always hungry. You eat like your father. You need help. No worries. Sit. Thank you. Hey. Mama for you. I actually kind of like the cover for you, actually. The color. Kind of like my juice. Bruh, good afternoon. Auntie, good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you? I'm fine, Auntie. But let me go and keep my firewood at the back. I'm coming. All right. Oh, you're uh, right? Yeah. So, Mama, um, we came here to tell you that um, Mary has accepted to marry me. Eh? Yes. Who can also say it again? <laughs> Mary has accepted to marry me. Oh, come on. Ah, Chinekenna. Father, I thank you. You are a good God. You have finally answered my prayers. Thank you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Do you know I have been praying to God eh, to do this miracle for me? And God has answered my prayer. Amen. You're welcome. Thank God you, has brought you in my house as my daughter-in-law. Child. Father. Mama. Hi. Mom. Hello. Hi. Congratulations. Thank you very much, Mama. Yes, as soon as we leave here, I'll be going to see her people. Because I want this marriage set in a month. We haven't agreed. They said as soon as possible. In a month. <laughs> see, it is good. Eh? Do you know if I'm a priest? I would have just waited both of you. Right now. I will not wait for tomorrow. Ah, mama. It's a, thank you, it's Mama. Like that. Don't worry. It's not done like that, Mama. Don't worry, everything will be fine. Huh? Oh yes, Mama. Um Yes. And meanwhile, I will stop by to see Uncle in the see. Okay. Yes, so I could um, tell him what's going on. It's it's very good. Yes. Oh as you people go, hmm? drive carefully. Hmm? Save Johnny. I pray. That the road we bow down before you Amen. in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. No way confirmed that against you shall ever prosper. Amen. Oh mom, as you go. Please, why you why you? What? Why you why you? Oh mom. Thank you. You go. Why you why you? What? I will. I will. Mm -hmm. I will. Huh? And behind you, we have girl stop to discuss. Girl stop. Girl stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright, mama. Okay. It's your mama. Oh, jump. Also, pa. Me, after all you spent on me in the hospital, oh, it's just a token for you to take care of yourself. Hey. I like seeing you strong hey. like this. Be scared. <laughs> Any money you give somebody is token, no matter how big the money is. This money that is enough to last me for the whole year. You are calling it the token. It's between us. I like this, you're talking. <laughs> I want talking, talking to be coming to me, talking. Hey. Hey. Oh, hey. God bless you. Um, brother, are you going? Oh. We are going. Thank you. Hey! Mom. Let me get some more. No, don't worry. Maybe some other time, huh? No, no, no. Okay, okay, no. Mama. Bye, Mama. Hey! Ah, hey! Okay. It's your man, oh? Okay, bye, bye, bye. Hey. Nene, go. Yes, Mama. Hey, hey, boy. Bring it. Mama, give me, you? give me. When they give you money, give it to your mother. That's how they do it. Yeah? Mama, bye! Okay, now, Julie, you're... Julie?
Hey. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Um, is Francis in? Oh, no, no. He drove out not quite long. He's come for work. Okay. Um, actually, I'm looking for Julie. I have been calling her since last night. And she, her phone is actually ringing, but she's not picking. I, I, I didn't see her last night. Oh. Uh, well, she did not come here. But, but, oh. I, I, I thought she got married last week, Saturday. Yes. And unfortunately, she lost her husband. What? Yeah. But she's been acting very funny since then. Oh, wow. So, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm sorry. Goodness. But like I said, she did not come here. But trust me, when she comes, I'll give you a call. Okay. Okay. Um, do take care of yourself. Thank you so much. All right. I'll be going. Oh, it's, it's all right. It's all right. All right. She was coming to this place. Um, uh, yes. Um, no, hey! I, is she? Mm, they have done something to my daughter. No, Mama. My enemies have succeeded. No, Mama, it hasn't gotten to that. No. They have succeeded in killing my daughter. Mama, they kill her! Mama, she's not dead. I not say she's dead. Uh. Um, don't worry, I know where to find her. I will, I will go to her room. Later. You know where to find her? Yes, ma'am. Can we go there together? No. Mama. Hey! Mama, Mama. I will, I, will, I will call her. Let me even call her. I think she should be there. I'll call you call her now. Call her here. Call you. I will come back. I will. Mama, I will come. Mama, I will come back. I will come back. You will come back? Yes, she should be in that girl's house. I forgot to tell you. Okay. Yes, ma'am. But why, why can't I just follow no, you? No, 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 Mama. You cannot. Hey, what? She's, she's even refusing me following her. My enemies will never succeed. They will never succeed. They can never do anything to my daughter. They will never. They will never. They will never do anything. Okay, no problem. So where do I go to now? I don't even know where to go to. Exactly. I saw her walking on the road like a mad woman. She was the whole thing. What? When? He died the day after their wedding. And since then, she's been behaving strangely. Oh. So sad.
Yeah, um, Annie was here today. She she said she was uh, looking for <coughs> Julie. Why is your face like that? You knew to have seen Julie today. She was looking like a mad woman. Nothing is left of that girl. Oh, you saw her already? Oh, yes. I saw her walking like a mad woman along the road. Under the hot sun. Ah. That girl is going through a lot. She's too young to be going through this. I, I don't even know what to say. And um, but did you ask her what actually happened to the husband? Uh, uh, but she, Is it an accident or But she, how can I ask her that type of stupid question? How? How do you expect me to ask her that? It's not fair now. All I know is that that girl is going through a lot. And I have to do something. I I I, I must do something to help her. <laughs> the no you will start. No no start. I have to, have to, have to, have to. What do you want to do? You won't go where they bury the husband, go wake up. But she, but she's pained. Really? Yes, yes, she's hurting. I. <sighs> uh, bro, you were pained too. You were hurting sometimes ago. I mean, everyone hurts when something bad happens. Wait, wait. What? Uh, um, Francis. Yes. <laughs> what? what? Tell me, say you want to start again? You want to start building this emotional thing again? Huh? Francis. Zara. I'm very sure. You will just get private work for psychiatric home. No, continue. You will lose big time. After, 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 after. Oh, God. <sighs> you see, like the nicest things here. The shoes are mud. I'm thinking that maybe we should start shopping. Like, you know, there's no. Francis. Yes. What was the last thing I just said? Ah. Uh, okay, so what's what's wrong with you? I'm fine. No, no, you're not fine. You're not listening, you're not interacting, you're not saying anything, you're not fine. What is wrong? Darling, trust me, I'm, I'm perfectly fine. No, no, you're absent-minded. You're not following. You're not a part of the conversation. I mean, I just said, let's start shopping. That should be fun, but you weren't responding. So that means something is bothering you. So what? I think I have an idea. You're worried about the money for our wedding. Right? Oh. You shouldn't be. I've saved a lot. I mean, I saved a whole lot. I mean, I've saved a little above 10 million now. What? Mm-hmm. 10 million now. Above. <laughs> oh, my God. Yes, so you shouldn't worry. We should just start shopping. Thank you so much, darling. You are... A lifesaver. <laughs> Thank you. What? Ten million? Above. <laughs> A little above. <gasps> Don't worry. I mean, we need to start planning and shopping because you think there's time and then you find out there's no time. The day is drawing closer and closer. Oh, yes. Uh, shopping. I think we should start shopping now. I'll show you the shoe I saw. Exactly. <laughs> <Smart>. <laughs> I hope this pleases you.
Thank you. You're welcome. How about we take a look? I don't feel up to it. Trust me, it's going to get ahead. Alright? Huh? Let's go. There's nothing wrong with loving someone, but it's terrible when you love the wrong one. Your heart and emotions will be toyed with. Yes, it will. The decisions and actions will be affected negatively. You'll be manipulated. Oh, and taking advantage of. Yeah. Even when you find the one that's good for you, you may never know because you are blinded by fantasy love. You are blinded by fantasy love. confusion and commotion in your life if you love the wrong one you will make wrong decisions take the wrong actions just to please them you could miss good opportunities instead you create animal cities just to please them just to please them you'll make mistakes that you will regret if you don't wake up to reality, it could be too late for you Because you could end up losing it all I just want to make you happy. Hmm? You've done enough. You've been nervous since yesterday. Extremely nervous. Something bothering you? Uh, darling, I'm not nervous. 
I'm fine. I'm, I'm just filled with joy. Uh, knowing that soon I will be your husband. Something I never dreamt of. You're kidding. And yeah, I was worried about you. Hey. Uh. This has been destined to be. Besides, you always knew how I felt about you. I mean, I never hid it from the start. Right? Yes. <laughs> yes. And, um, I wish I had words to express my feelings for you. Um. I love you. I know. I really do. <laughs> I really know. <laughs> Besides, you make me so happy. And I'm excited that it's vice versa, you know. Also, we're going clubbing tonight. You need to meet some very important people in the city. Tonight? Uh-huh. Uh, why, why don't we make it tomorrow? You know? Why? You have an appointment tonight? Uh, no, I. I just felt we need to spend some time together. I mean, <laughs> in the room. Oh God, you and bedroom matters. We go to the club today because I want to introduce you to someone. All right. So club it is. <sighs> club it is. Awesome. Anything for you, darling. <laughs> Cheers. What's going on? Are you trying to sell this property? Who wants to know? Best, your late brother left this property for me. As far as I am concerned, you are not a part of my family. And you deserve no explanations to what I choose to do with my brother's property. Yes, I am his legal wife. So I am his illegal brother? Don't make me angry. Get out of this place now. Is everything alright? Yes, yes, yes. yes. See, don't mind all these stupid scammers looking for wool to scam. They are asking rubbish questions. Okay. Um, follow me, so I'll show you the back of this place. Okay, that back. You're going to like it. Okay. Yes. You see, you need to have everything you need to be able You slept off before I finished my dinner last night. And this morning you woke up, you're acting more funny. What is it? I went to see the property Miles left for me. And I'm getting there. I saw his brother with a buyer trying to sell the property. I won't let that happen. I will go to court. <laughs> Julie, you really do not want to go down this route with his family. How many people think you got married to him because of his will? I was the only one who accepted to marry him. I was the only woman who accepted to grant him his last wish, which was sitting by his side while he took his last breath. I deserve better. You know, now this whole thing is getting clear to me. Like, it's getting clearer every day that you have an ulterior motive. Yes. Well, 
that is left between me and God. You do not expect me to sit down and do nothing while to take my late husband's property. Why didn't you fight back the day his brother asked you to return the car that he bought for you? You want to go to court to fight over a property you do not even have access to the documents. I will go to his mother. She'll give it to me. I wish you all the best. <laughs> Babe, can you imagine? I saw Bex trying to sell the property miles left from you. Miles, brother. The thing is, if you succeed in selling this property, I will have nothing left. That's good. I would like to go with you when you're going. Why did you sell for purposes? My friend, I asked you a question. I said, why did you sell for purposes? What? You call me a madman? Fine. I'll show you what madmen do. Alright? I'll show you what madmen do. Francis, I still do not understand why you would go on such intervention with that girl. Eh? Why you don't know where and how they started? What do you mean of this now? Is this the right time to say this kind of things? Why will you try to make me feel bad now? Allow me or... Allow me or you, you just collect this towel and start pressing my back for me. Can you just hear yourself talk? Huh? Just hear yourself talk. Okay, see, see what she has put you in. And why is she not here to see how you're doing, if your bones are still complete or not? I, I'm sure she's still trying to process what happened. She, she, she'll still be in shock. Why are you stressing yourself? Francis, did you say shock? Yes. My guy, you were beaten to stupor. You were beating her pet. Thank God you survived it. And all you could say is she's in shock. Who told you that? Is, is that what I told you? Thank Who God told you I was, I was beaten? I was fighting, my friend. What are you saying? Stop this rubbish. <laughs> I was fighting to defend her. That's what happened. To scare your facts, right? Ah. Wait, wait, Francis, I don't get it. This love thing don't scatter your head, though. Why do you hate this girl so much? No, tell me, I, I, because I don't understand. Why do you hate her so much? Every time when it comes to her case, you just, you just take it personal. Why do you hate her so much? Francis, I don't hate her. Francis, you're my friend, you're my guy. We stay in the same apartment. I mean... It's, it's, it's enough reason for me to show concern. Gucci, enough. I don't want to talk about this thing again. Eh? The best thing you can do for me now is go inside and, and get more hot water and, and, and bring, bring for me so I'll press my back. What's all this one now? Look, I'm, I'm, I'm only saying this. I'm only saying Please, this. I don't, don't say again. Please don't say again. I don't want. Don't say again. Ah. Francis, you either drop from one trouble to another because of this same particular girl. You know what I call it? Blessing in disguise. You think you just stay and then you just be blessed like that. Sometimes you go through through things now. You go through situations so that when the blessing comes, you, you appreciate it. And to me, this is how I see it though. I see this as blessing in disguise. Please just leave me alone. Let me, uh, let me suffer my suffer then. I'm sure very soon I'll enjoy my enjoyment. Okay, but, but I keep on saying this. Don't say I did not tell you. Don't Please say stop I did telling not me. Tell stop you. telling me. It's all right. Help your own. Things and put you through this. Put 
put me through through what? <laughs> Listen, you have to stop crying. All right? You know I hate to see you like that. Please stop crying. Darling, please. You don't understand. I'm so ashamed of myself. I'm so ashamed. Why will you be ashamed of yourself? Could anyone tell you anything? Why are you not saying a word, darling? Talk to me. What is this about? I don't know if you're ready for this. Ready for all the time. What is it? You mean I'm, I'm going to be your father? <laughs> You're not angry. Why am I supposed to be angry? Like this is the best news I've had in the long while. You're going to be my wife, and I'm going to be your husband. Just get ready. I'll be right back. <laughs> now you're pregnant. Very good. I guess the family will know you have responsibilities to you. Emily's mother will be very happy to hear the news that she will be having a grandchild. She will not have any grandchild. I don't understand. Are you going to keep this information from them? Balance will not touch you. What are you saying? So we just want to know. The more responsible is our way. Who's there? Hold on, please. Julie. Julie. You see, fate has put us enough to put us in the right place. My love for you is immeasurable. So please, I ask you this question. Please, be my wife. She said yes. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Thank you so much. I love you. Well, I love you too. I love you. I've always loved you. I don't seem to understand this. Julie is what for you? She's pregnant for me now. Francis. Hmm? How did you let that happen? Well, I've always loved Julie. You know that. I've never stopped loving her. Oh, God. Uh, okay, well, what happens to me? And the wedding plans? What happens to all of that? 
I don't know. Uh, I think we'll just find a way around it. That's all. Really? Yes. you find a way around it, you be wicked boy. Just go straight to the point. No, 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 no. no. Go straight to the point. Just say, I will break her heart. It's as simple as that. No. After all that gay has done for you. <laughs> Richie, why are you sounding like this? Huh? No, tell me, why, 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 are, you, why are you so, so aggressive about the whole thing? Is, is it your problem? Is she related to you? Stop this, for God's sake. Stop it. Stop it, please. I don't like it. What she has done, what, what, what has she done for me? Eh? No, tell me, what has she done for me? Did I ask her for anything? You and I know that she did everything she did for me because of obsession. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Just hold it right there. Uh, correction number one. Me and you don't know anything. Then number two, you be very wicked boy. In great time you be. No problem, no. Francis, so you can actually say this, huh? To a woman that gave you life. Francis, what? a woman that gave you life. What do you mean by that? Gave me which life? Is she God? How can you say a woman that gave me life? Do women give life? Why would you say she gave me life? Besides, if I was not handsome, she wouldn't have noticed me. Really? Ah, yes, really. Okay, wait. So as you there, so you fine. Now if they say me fine boy come out, because you fell, and they say me fine boy is come out, now we, when we do fine, we know if he come out, now you go call come out. You know what? I will sit right here and watch you regret every actions of yours. God forbid. I'm not going to regret anything. Oh, really? Yes, I will not regret anything. What was this thing you were saying about you being fine? I don't understand. Fine how? I just, I just, I don't tell you say like I fine, like I fine. I just tell you say I fine. I know, no expansion. And I leave, leave my fine like this. I was, see, but I was Francis, worried. I, I know, I know it is your ploy. Not be you again. I know you they stay the same. I would share boxers sometimes. I know this is about Julie's late husband's properties, right? <laughs> but don't worry. Soon, I will leave this house for you. So I will not be counted among Bad, bad, in fact, I don't know which I will talk. So I'm not going to feast in America, they do all these dubious plants, with the plant out together. No problem now. If you like, you can go and live inside the bush. As a matter of fact, I need space. Since she's pregnant, very soon Junior will come. I'll need space in the house for my child to be running around. Mm, I need space. I'll start thinking about marriage now. I'm not getting any younger. It's not your fault. She, she because she might need to start with bush, she's in my ghosty bush. See, cause not that bushy bush. Let me make it. You know, you're not see anywhere talk same as we stay in a bush. It's a good thing you're running with it. Bush and bush. You can even start your own album with it. Mama. Yeah. I will hold you by the phone to tell you about her. But I decided to bring her to you. Mm. Oh, this is Julie. And as you can see, Julia and I are getting married. I don't understand. When I said Julia and I are getting married, so mm. let me take it to my room. Slap you again. 
Let her go to that your room and take her girl out of this house. Out! What I will do to her, you will live to remember it. Nonsense. I don't think what you're about to do is right. You just lost your husband a few weeks ago and you want to do this. Listen, if your mother-in-law does not support this, your mother will not support this. I do not care what my mother feels about my decision. But you don't want to have an illegitimate son. Fine. But why not just wait? At least people are still mourning. Give people time to mourn. I'm just begging you. Annie? I respect you a lot. And I do not want to lose our respect. This is my decision. And if you're not going to support me, then you shut up. Okay, but at least before I shut up, can I make a poor password gesture, please? You can travel with him somewhere else, relocate, go to another town, another country, just do something, but leave this place. What are you doing here? See, why don't you get married? You have no right to come to my house uninvited. Really? Since that night we met at the bar, you have refused to pick my calls. Didn't you enjoy the time we spent together? That night was a huge mistake. Each time I remember it, I regret it with everything in me. Really? Huge mistake. A huge mistake. And yet, you scream my name out loud. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. See what I've done to myself. Done to myself. Oh, see what I've done to myself. Done to myself. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. Now I have hurt and maybe lost The one truly loves me The one who's been there for me The one that's really meant for me Really meant for me Yet you followed me from the bar to the guitar Just to enjoy what you've missed for a long time Here you are, talking rubbish Bobby, I am trying so hard not to insult you. Leave this place. Enough of this nonsense. Get out! I love your pregnancy. Mm -hmm. Why do you want to give my child to another man? I have no idea what you're talking about. No clue at all. Because of my work in the same hospital where you did your pregnancy tests. So I asked again, why do you want to give my child to another man? What makes you think the baby belongs to you? John. My man can equally perform, so this baby is his. Don't lie to me. Do not get in this. Don't get out. Get out. Out. I am old enough to know who got me pregnant, and I say it is not you. Leave! One million naira, no leave. I'll never bother you again.
But failure to do that, I would hang around until the day of the wedding. You know what that means? Excuse me. So, damn! What have I gotten myself into? No, 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 this is not good for me. This is not good for me. Oh yes, Adam. It's going to be in two days. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, I know, I know. The special one. <laughs> no problem. No problem. Be happy for you. I'm cool. Hey. So it's true. I was planning to come. At what point were you going to tell me? To what end? Tell me the truth. So what happens to me? What happens to my emotions and everything? I'm sorry. I just realized that just I still don't. love her. You still love her? And, and you couldn't tell me? I ask again what happens to me? And all the wedding plans and everything. I don't. don't. You have done so much and you have always gotten away with it. On this one, you will pay for this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? solve it as soon as possible. Well, I'll leave it if I get the money for you tomorrow. Oh, no, 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 you cannot transfer. Transfer the money right now. I, I, need, I need to solve something, like, right now. I, I know, I know. The problem now is I'm expecting some money from the client tomorrow. So not to worry, if he makes the payment tomorrow, I'll just I'll send the money to you. Okay? All right? So what do you need the money for? My mother, she is sick. She's booked for an operation on Monday. Please help me. I don't want her to die. Please. Please. Please, Abike. The thing there is that, you know, I'm finishing up my house. And currently, as we speak, I don't even have up to $200,000 hey. on my account. Abike, please. I don't want her to die. She has suffered a lot. Please help me. I will pay back. I promise I will pay you back. Please help me. Help me, please. Please. 
Actually, there's a woman that lent my auntie some money some time ago. It's because of you. I could tell my auntie to talk to her. Hey, thank you. If, if you do this for me, I will be so grateful. It's okay, Please it's help okay. me. I promise it's I will okay. pay you back. Oh. It's okay. It's not okay. Just let me, let me even get my answer before. Hey, now. thank you. Thank you it's so okay. much. It's thank for you. you. Now. It's for you. Just because thank it's you. you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, I'm a big guy. So, my madam, I did Oh, okay, okay, okay. I don't know, let's go inside. to call it no I know it's nice to those weeks it's coming down uh, um sorry let me answer my sister I'm coming please everything to gather this money and give to you. You know things are very well for me right now. Obi, what you're doing is not fair. It's not fair. Called and she was really worried, so I told her to come down and that I was going to help in whichever way I could best. But actually, you know about me, it's for my neighbor. Her mother is sick and she needs money for surgery. And she did not come with you? She came with me. Um, she got a call. I think she's talking with her sister. I said I'm going to give you the money. Why, why, why are you using this blackmail to hurt me? Hello? Hello? Bobby? Oh, okay, that's, that's fine. That's fine. So here's the money. Oh, okay. thank you very much. You're so kind. <laughs> it's nothing, really. Let me get you a drink, right? Thank you. Thank you. That's all. You? Julie? Yes? Who are you? My name is May. I was engaged to Francis. I am engaged to Francis. I mean, we were planning to get married and all of a sudden he comes back to me and says he wants to go back to his ex. So, do you have a problem with that? Yes, I mean, no, I mean, I mean, after everything, do you really love him? Or you just want to use him to heal yourself? What's 
sort of stupid question is that? Well, he's simply tired of being a sugar boy to a sugar mommy. So if he dumps you, it simply means he is tired of you. But no, wait, you, you just called me a sugar mommy. Of course. Uh, isn't it obvious? Sugar mommy. No, excuse me. No, wait, no, I'm not, I'm, wait, no, I'm, no, not sugar mommy. So you really intend to use my money to plan your wedding? You? You? Abike? Why didn't you tell me she's the one? I don't understand. You guys know each other. Why, well, yes we do. Because she called me a sugar mommy. No, don't, don't bend your head. Don't bend your head. That's what you said. You called me a sugar mommy. You don't love him anymore. But you just want solace. So go ahead and enjoy yourself. Abike, take her out of my house. Before you do that. Wait, wait. Wait, I'm going to close, close to you. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. What's going on? Abike. You have tried. Maybe it is time for me to pay for my sins. I don't understand. Maybe if you tell me what's going on, I might actually bring a solution for you. Don't worry. You've done well. Thank you. Julie. Julie. Man, I'm just so confused. So you want to render me jobless just because I refuse to marry you, eh? You're a very wicked person. I swear to God, you're very wicked. But don't worry. God will not shame me. You see it yourself. God is not going to shame me. Very well then. We shall see. Shame me. Nonsense. What's that? Just drive over. The personal issue. Madam, Mr. Francis is here to see you. I'm all ears. Mr. Rex, Mr. take the keys from him and drive the car to the house. Um, Mr. Francis, this is our boss. You can lay your complaints to her. I... I don't understand. Who froze your account? I mean, why was your account frozen? I just feel like running away. You don't have to sound that way. We need to look for a solution. So, so, somehow, we need to solve this. I don't have money! You're shouting at me!
now to zero from something now to nothing all because I blindly fell for someone you who doesn't care for me why do you know who doesn't love me oh, I, I was one but I didn't listen What's going on? You're behaving like someone who's about to be blackmailed. Is there something you're not telling me? No. She said I need the money. I need this money. Have you asked them? She does not have. She even went to see her sick mother in the village this evening. No. No, no, no. I, I don't think I'm ready to see anybody. I'm not in the right frame. My head is to come. No, don't worry. I asked you to get this in my head. Huh? Yo, who's that? A piece of good meat onto this house. Yes. Um, please, who are you? Drama queen. With a nice drama. Young man, she asked the question. Who are you and why are you here? Okay. I am looking for my sweetheart. And her name is Jenny. Excuse you? Who is your sweetheart? I mean, I, I, who are you looking for? How can you call me your sweetheart? Do I know you? Should I tell you? Hey, 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 hey! What exactly is going on here? What's going on? I'll tell you. What's wrong? To ask you this question before I was rudely interrupted. <coughs> now, the question is. <coughs> hey, Bobo, my mom is spending me here. Here, here. Will it be fair if you allow a woman to take your child to another man? Will it be fair? This young lady here is carrying my child. Excuse me, sorry. Um, sorry? What did you say? She says this is a madman. A madman just walked in here talking trash. What are you talking about? A madman? What, what are you talking about? What is he talking about? I don't even know. Okay, very well. <clears throat> Since she doesn't know what I'm talking about, and I'm a bad man. Maybe it will interest you to know if I show you some of those pictures. Those are the pictures that will confirm that this man here is not a madman. Is that not you? It's a little picture. B. You know what computer can do these days? This picture is obviously photoshopped. I found you quiet. Is this not the same clothes you were wearing today? Pick you up in the boot. Good. <clears throat> now tell me. Is that child his or not? Finished me. All because of you I lost my job. Lost my friend. 
I lost my family and now I lost my joy. Oh, that is what was I thinking. Stop! You are a devil. You irritate me. Don't come. Yeah, my. I'll be coming back for my job. Right? He's a nice guy anyway. But I, I'm sorry. I better take my. <clears throat> you are a devil. Oh, you are heartless. God will punish you. My God will punish you. Nothing, all because I blindly fell for someone who doesn't care for me, who doesn't love me. I was warned, but I didn't listen. Put you up dead. Oh, come on, you can't be dead now, huh? And a dead man still talk. See, be serious. What, what's the problem? <laughs> it's, 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 wait, wait. It's, it's, it's from all right. Just talk to me. Julius, finish me. Look, if you don't want me to leave this place, don't mention that name again. For God's sake, how many times do you want to be beaten before you go get sense, bros? You just calm down and hear me out. Let's talk to me now. Okay, okay, fine. Bros, I don't put my two here, do you? Remember I told you I was expecting a child. Mm -hmm. It was not my child. She was pregnant for her ex-boyfriend. <laughs> really? What you, what you, why are you laughing now? Wait, 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 wait. So Junior is not coming to this house anymore? <laughs> you complicated this on me. Really? I almost thought you are going to remove the couch, everything, the TV, everything, so there will be no space for Junior to play. <laughs> <laughs> My brother, good night. Good night. What do you mean that you go and rent a two place so that you have a place, this place where they'll be playing cartoons and <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
Hey, Julie. I've never seen you in this mood before. What's going on?
Good morning, Olga. Good morning. Morning. Uh, please, is your madam inside? Yes, Olga, but she there with Fessing. Uh, all right. Go inside and tell her I'm here to see her. Do Olga. Hey. Tell her I'm here. I'm here. Okay. My madam say make I tell you Chewa. What, what did she say? Say you in fact, Oga. I asked her to tell you to go to hell and rot there. Me. Me. Listen, I fucked up. Okay, I I I know I messed up, but please, I beg you, forgive me. Are you listening to yourself? Franz. I loved you. And because I loved you, I became weak. And that makes you think I'm stupid. No. You are the one who's stupid. Me, it's not like that. Okay, I I I, I was confused. Yes, I, I I was carried away, but in short, I was stupid. Perfect. I was very stupid. So go home and wallow in that stupidity. May. May. Please. Hey, I'm sorry. Oh, I regret. I'm full sorry. of regret. What am I gonna do? What have I done to myself? Done to myself. What have I done to myself? Done to myself. See what I've done to myself. Done to myself. Oh. Kai, 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 kai. I don't know why some people for this life, they don't know how to use their law. Gaskia, how confess and see my madam, my good madam, and he go let them go just like that. Kai, some people for this life. It's not my problem. It's his own cup of chai. Ime wara mi ju eburu chimu. O me mamu. Ime wara mi ju eburu dogu. O ni me ni gwe. Ime wara mi ju eburu chugu. Mama, Mama, good afternoon. What are you doing here, Francis? Francis, what are you doing here? I thought I told you never to come and see me. What are Mama and Alan and say? I told you never to come and see me, Francis. Yes, Mama, you told me. But Mama, I'm in a total mess now. My life is a mess. Why won't you be in a mess? Why won't you be in a mess when you started behaving like a stray dog? Yes, that's what I am. A stray dog. But please, Mama. I... I want you to come and help me talk to me. Beg her to... To forgive me. Me? Yes. Help you. Beg me to forgive you. Yes, ma'am. Me? Mammy. It's not possible. By the way, what about your new love, Julie? Mama, don't, 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 don't ask me about that halot again, please. Don't. What right do you have to call her that name? You, what are you? Mama, do you know what she did to me? She was pregnant, I thought it was my baby. Not knowing the child belonged to her ex. If, if not that the guy came to the house the other day, I wouldn't have found out. Mama, please. <laughs> hey! Why are you telling me all this? Why? Hmm? So you have the face, Francis. Mama. You have the face to come here and ask me 
to help you beg me when you refuse to listen to my advice. I have learned my lessons. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <clears throat> you have not learned your lesson. You still need to learn more. Hmm? Still need to learn more. Makanonya patalin kwaru. Simbele deli olole. Yanane? Mama, are you saying you're not going to help me? I will not help you. Mama, you have to help me. You have to help me. Else I'm going to take my own life and you'll be held responsible for that. Mama, please, you have to help me. Please. Please, I beg you. Please. Mama, please, my, my head is on fire now. I beg you. Please. Mama, please. Francis! Mommy, please. Please, Mama. Help me. Help me beg her to forgive me. Please. Help me only, son. Please, Mama. Francis! Francis! Mama, please. You're gonna need much enough blackmail, Francis! Mama, I'm sorry. <laughs> please, Mama. Stand up! Wait for me. Okay, Mama. What am I gonna do? What have I done to myself? What have I done to myself? Mama, knock very well. Someone is inside. How are you? Fine. Is your mother in the house? Yes, hey, madam. Okay. Please uh, help me tell her that Francis' mother is here to see her. Oh. Oh, my son, it was not my fault. Yeah, it was my fault. Uh, you are here? Yes. Why well, you shouldn't have stressed yourself. Better still. You should have called me that you want to come and I'll send somebody to come get you. Don't worry. I'm here already. Oh? I'm here already. Because we, we need to talk. Oh, I'm, I'm very certain that he made you come here, Mama. He stressed you and brought you here. I don't want him inside my house. His presence alone irritates me. My daughter, you're, 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 I understand your feelings. Eh? I understand your feelings. You have every right to feel the way you, you do. But please, for my sake, oh, we need to talk. I might hate to see you stress yourself, but honestly, I can't let him in. Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Please. Oh? Please. Come, Mama. I cannot believe that after everything I did for Francis, he will betray me. He will betray me so terribly. You stabbed me in the back and you treated me so harshly after everything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for all my wrong deeds. Please forgive me. I'm so sorry. Not one word from you, Francis. After everything you did to me, no woman will forgive you. Not to talk of taking you back. No woman will take you back. I know. My daughter, please, I understand how you feel. But I'm here to beg you to forgive him. But taking him back, that is your decision to make. Please just forgive him. He didn't do well at all. Mama. Mama. I love you. I know. And I respect you a lot. Mama. You are the only reason why France. Why am I even calling you France? Why Francis is seated here now? If it wasn't for you, I would not even let his feet into my house. And because of the love and respect I have for you, Mama, I will say I have heard you. And I will think about it. But Thank you, Mom. 
Thank you. God bless you. Oh, God bless you. Thank you so much. Not one word. Mbakaena. Kaena. I'm sorry, please. I am begging you, my love of God. Please do not go without one child. Julie, Julie, honestly, I know I messed up big time. I'm sorry. I, look, I'm only being concerned about our born child. Right? I couldn't have just allowed you to, to go with that guy. I, I beg you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. I'll be alright with that. Sure, you go see me now. Right. <laughs> I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. But I've not eaten since yesterday. Yeah. Just eat a little. I just said I'm not hungry now. Is it by force to eat food? I'm not hungry. Leave me alone. Nah. Eat something. Mama, Mama, I'm not hungry, please. I'm not hungry. Eat kitchen. Mama. Take the food inside. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, welcome. Good afternoon. You? Oh, you're welcome. welcome. God bless you. You're welcome. Um, Mama, Thank I you. decided to come and see you and to ask how you are feeling. As you can see, I am well and strong. I'm happy to see you this you're way. You're welcome. Hey, let me go and get something for you to eat. Oh, no, Mama. Honestly, I'm, I'm not hungry at all. Really? Mm -hmm. uh, what about the thing I ask you to think about? Have you come out with an answer? Mama. Yes. You know I love you. And I respect you a lot. So for your sake, yeah. I forgive him. Ah, thank you very much. God bless <sighs> you. Thank you. I forgive you. Thank you. Oh, mom. Yes, mama. Thank you very much, darling. <laughs> I'm a changed man now. And also, mama, I don't have anything in mind against him. Okay. But I also do not want to have anything to do with him. Not romantically and not in my business either. Babe. Darling, Be kind please. enough not to come close to me or touch me while you talk. As I was saying, Mama, I honestly bear no grudge against him. I just wanted you to know that I love you so much and for your sake I let it go. But you thank God you're here. Please let me talk to her. Okay? I, I, I don't want to lose her. Please. I love her so much. Um, Mama, I also forgot to tell you something very important the last time I'll be traveling you know for a couple of weeks because I'm preparing to get married I forgot to give you my wedding invitation card so I brought it here and Mama, I honestly want for you to start something even though I'm going to be checking up on you from time to time so I also wrote you a surprise check <laughs> but please don't cry Gee, you're not saying anything Gucci. <laughs> You're not saying anything. What's, what's, what's going on? Francis, I'm sorry, okay? What's going on? How do I talk to her? Okay, I, 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 don't, I don't want to lose her. I, I, I'm a changed man now. <laughs> yes, you saw the, you saw the card. Me, they changed the name. I have to go now. <laughs> don't. Uchi! Don't. Oh, I'm full of regret. <laughs> What have I done to myself? 
What's going on here? Why, why are you playing my door now? Huh? Madam asked for to come and lock up this house. How? I don't understand. What do you mean by that? Lock my house? Why? When last did you pay your rent? What kind of nonsense question is that? Huh? What business do you have when I paid my rent last? She's the landlady of this house. For your bags, they are at the back of the house. Hey, and um, we've sent the property to um, Buchispa. He said he owns the property. From something now to nothing, all because I blindly fell for someone. Who doesn't care for me? Who doesn't love me? I was warned, but I didn't listen. Now in the hard way, I've learned my lesson. Oh, I will. Danny, I, I seriously need your help. I'm, I'm losing it. Please. I need your help. Okay, because you need my help now, yeah? You're in trouble now, you need my help. But remember, I asked which to call you and you refused to come. And you told him that you mind my business. Listen, I was under a spell. That useless girl used charms on me. Yeah, please, you have to hear me out. So what do you want me to do now? Tani, um, I need a roof over my head. I can't go back to the village like this. I need to, I need to stay back here and, and, and push harder, you know? Anyway, I know now I don't stay here anymore. I only came to see my landlord and pick some of the things, okay? Okay, um, can I, can I at least stay in your house? Huh? For some time? Guy, my fiancé will not allow that. You know? She won't. Why, why are you, why are you sounding like this now? There's nothing I can do, guy. Please. Tani, please, just for, uh, okay, at least for a few days, let me just put myself together. I'm sure I'll come up with something. It's not my problem. It's for me, I will do it for you, but my fiancé will not allow that. I don't want her to get upset. Yeah, please. Your own house. So is there nothing you, nothing you can do right now for me? Just, just like that? and begging and coming here to kneel down it's no longer funny I mean it's not safe for me it is no longer safe May where there is no sin there is no forgiveness even the Bible says alas you are going to discuss the Bible you 
will open your mouth and talk about the Holy Bible. Listen, Francis, I do not want to have anything to do with you. I don't intend to rethink my decision. I do not want to have anything to do with you. I would rather kiss a toilet seat than have anything to do with you. I would rather die than be with you. What? Do you understand? Why would you say a thing like that? Don't, don't, don't think about the good times. Please, I beg you. No, no. Please. Did you hear me? This is no longer safe. But you, you know I love this woman so much. Why would you try to take her away from me? Why? Francis, why don't you just leave, okay? But talk to me! What's wrong with Hey, babe. Francis came back and he's been begging and crying that he wants to be back. Perhaps you have something to say to him. Francis, me and I are getting married. And Buchi here happens to be the best man. So, I would advise you to turn back and leave or for the police to do that for you. Did you hear that? You're going to get arrested. He's going to get the cops to arrest you. You are going to get picked up. You and your Gucci cap, you're going to get picked up. You have to leave. You're going to get arrested. Yeah, think about it. Think about it. You, the tears, the Gucci cap. You're going to get arrested. It's all right. I'll leave. From something now to nothing all because i blindly fell for someone who doesn't care for me who doesn't love me i was warned but i didn't listen now in the hard way i've learned my lesson oh i regret i'm full of regret what am i gonna do what have i done to myself, done to myself. what have i done to myself i think it is time for me to go and reconcile with you at least I'll have a shelter in my head. Tie. Sure. You're gonna wear a tie, right? Mm. But you're going to change this belt. Sure. I don't think. Um... That is my old belt, not the one I bought from that Calabaga. That now. Change it. Okay. You know tomorrow is going to be do. Oh, you can say
there's nothing wrong with loving someone, but it's terrible when you love the wrong one. Your heart and emotions will be tied with, yes it will, the decisions and actions will be affected negatively. You'll be manipulated, oh, and taken advantage of, yeah. Even when you find the one that's good for you, you may never know because you were blinded by fantasy love. You were blinded by. Brother, where have you been for the past six days? Mama has been looking for you everywhere. The world has been turning me around. <sighs> and around. And now it has brought me back to the same place I started my journey. But I really feel your pain. But this is something you could have prevented. Imagine you going from grass to grace and then from grace to the mud. I wish everyone could learn from my story. You all have the right to call me stupid. Yes, I was. Because I shot myself on the leg. Brother, it's okay. Let me get you something to eat. Food is not my problem right now. It is not my problem. To myself, to myself. Now I have heard and made a love okay, let me take The one who truly loves me The one who's been there for me The one that's really meant for me Really meant for me The one that truly loves me Oh all because I was blinded by my fantasy love for the wrong person who doesn't love me. Oh, now looks like I've lost it all. What am I gonna do? Will I ever get it all back again? Me, please forgive him. Hmm? He has realized his mistakes. Obiko. I'm not a bad person. Circumstances only got me stupid. But please, forgive me. No more errors. No more. No second chances. Yes. Don't cry. Mama! Mama! I promise Mama. you. Mama. I will never let you down Mama. again. I promise you. Who are you going to make it up to? Um, has it been long you've been sleeping here? Where's Mama? She travelled. Travelled? Yes. Mama went with Auntie May to France for her wedding. I'm surprised she didn't tell you. What? Mm. Brother, I don't know why you say that you're You really fucked up, oh? Anyways, I'll be going back to school tomorrow. So, try and know how to do yourself. Hmm? Stop sleeping over here. Don't know. I'll never forgive myself for this. Oh. 
I'll never forgive myself for this. I'll never forgive myself for this. Thing. It's the best thing to do. 